Hey guys, we watched the entire Kung Fu Panda franchise, all the movies and the amazing TV shows. And if you want more sweet reactions, then comment what you'd like to see down below and like the video. Also, we have a plushie out right now. Click the link in the top of the description. Makeship did a great job with the design, so I hope you guys enjoy it. It's only available till May 22nd, so buy it before it's gone forever. Subscribe! <laughs> Oh my, I remember when this movie came out, bro. I was like, this is the coolest movie ever. You're like two years old. Dude, I came out the womb and I was like, I'm a Kung Fu Panda. Started doing, Legend started dressing up in panda outfits, bro. The warrior said nothing for his mouth was full. Then he swallowed. It's giving Luffy vibes. It's giving Luffy energy right now. I'm not even gonna fin a cap. Bro, Jack Black should 100% play Luffy in the live action adaptation. Maybe they still keep the same kid, but Jack Black just voices. <laughs> they just ADR him in. There is no charge for awesomeness or attractiveness. Oh, the girls are into it. The girls are screaming over Poe. Poe was like the original dad bod. Look at Poe RN, bro. Like, look at him. He's going hard. I do that a lot. And so loved. Bro, that was the goddamn Skyrim noise. But hanging out would have to wait. God, the fucking colors look so good. Dog, this shit looks like kill a kill. This is such a fun way to open a movie. Oh, get up. Dude, this looks so beautiful. What the f***? The lighting and everything? Martin Scorsese or whatever, Martin Caesar Pants uh, said that this was actually the most beautiful animated movie at the time. Well, I, I heard like Kubrick wanted to direct this movie, but like he never got the chance. Uh, is he like a 30 year old that still lives with his parents or how old is Poe? I, I, I do want to imagine he's just the same age as Jack Black. He's like 40. He's 23? Oh. So he is just like, he's, you know, he's post college. He went to Panda College and he. Well, it's normal in Asian and European countries to live with your parents into your early 20s, so. That's true. Isn't it like pandas are famous for like not wanting to fuck? Right? Like, that's what they're literally going extinct because they can't True. get them to fuck each other, so. It's, it sucks, because pandas are, like, the best animal, and, like, they just don't want to fuck. If I was a panda, I'd be fucking. <laughs> they want to go extinct. They're like, please, let us die out. But, Dad, didn't you ever, I don't know, want to do something else? This is such an interesting way of framing the movie, because he, he feels like he doesn't fit into the noodle shop, and he literally doesn't fit inside of it. <laughs> Look at this. He is literally stuck inside of it. He's too big. Keen observation, Sir Jack. Put some very, like, slightly sad, dramatic music under that, and you've got yourself a great cartoon analysis video. We got a, we're, we're, we got a video essay in the making, guys. We got this. He literally doesn't fit inside of the location. That's some beautiful symbolism. He could lose some weight, but, you know... That's hard. Why must something be wrong for me to want to see my old friend? He's got the stripper pole, though. He's moving so essentially down that pole, bro. Uguay had a tribulant past. He used to be a stripper in his in his older times. The whole valley will be there, and you'll sell noodles to all of them. Dude, his dad's a hustler, though, like, low-key. <laughs> you like, gotta respect. You gotta for respect. For real. For a duck who doesn't have a human mouth, he, like, they just do such a fantastic way of just giving him the most light likable smile ever yeah the most kissable bill he's that type of dad you want to have drooling emoji what the fuck do you mean what the the hell? wait what, what does that what mean the he's the type of dad that's you want to have drooling levels. emoji that's fucked up in many ways <laughs> oh. Am I being an annoying hipster if I say that I feel like DreamWorks ceiling in the past 15 years is higher than Disney ceiling, even though Disney movies are just on average better. Is that like safe to say? Because I feel like DreamWorks mm. takes more risks, you know what I mean, than Disney. I do agree with that. Disney movies usually play it way too safe. DreamWorks puts out a shit ton of duds, but like, yeah, when they hit, they hit. Dude, this is the first time I say an opinion and chat agrees with me, bro. This is the breakthrough <laughs> moment. Right Eden, I'm so proud of you. First good take let the tournament begin with the tournament arc dude it's like fucking dragon ball z man so dude this is just like my boku no hero academia oh my goodness are they gonna have pose little peeps too what, what the, the fuck, fuck? Are... that's the most important part of dragon ball oh oh, oh i was like oh, what are you oh. what are you <laughs> that's where you were about... going with that okay <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm pretty sure they're these are all just famous actors voice all these characters. Isn't Seth Rogen like the praying mantis? I think Seth Rogen is the mantis, and I think like Angelina Jolie plays Tigress. Tigress kinda what? Kinda what? Don't say kinda what. You know Tigress kinda. And his blades of death. Okay, yeah, I agree. I've come around. Shut up. Mantis. Oh. Monkey. Oh my god, Seth Rogen's about to talk. He's gonna be like, uh, 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 uh. Hey, Jack Black, I mean, uh, uh, Bo, Bo, how you doing, Aaron? Are you pointing at me? Him. <laughs> Master Uga is just a troll, man, at this point. He, this wasn't even faded or anything. He just thought it would be funny. He's in for the joke. You know, I respect he's in for the joke. I respect Uga. He's trying to film one last prank, prank video before he kicks it. That Flabby Panda can't possibly be the answer to- Why'd you gotta call him Flabby like that? Fat phobia right there. That's fat phobia. All pandas are fat. If all pandas are fat, then are they even fat? That's true. Wouldn't they just be a normal panda? Maybe maybe he's extra fat, even by panda standards. Dude, we can make a fucking whole video essay about the fat phobia of Kung Fu Panda. Like, this is honestly disgusting. What? Double the guard? Extra precautions? <laughs> Look at the rhino n****. Though. Oh, and why'd you have to point them out, man? They're distinct. Oh, yeah, what the fuck? They're so realistic. <laughs> they did, they are... just, did they just photocopy my nipples? What the? They shot the nipples in live action. <laughs> Bro, the level design goes hard, though. This looks like Don. This looks like Don Cheadle's uh, prison from Dark Souls 2. <laughs> what? Dark Souls fans will get it, bro. Just leave it in the video. <gasps> the feather. The feather. He uses the feather to break the chains. What? How is that random feather gonna sit? He's gonna fly out of the prison, obviously. Oh, but the feather's gonna use it as wings, and he's gonna fly like the little bird. Yeah. Master flying rhino's armor with authentic battle damage. Whoa. He really is the ultimate nerd. The ultimate Redditor. Well, I think that's the rise of Reddit. Like, didn't Reddit's, like, <laughs> user base expand a lot after this movie? Mm -hmm. They're like, damn. He's a nerd just like He's me. like, oh, I can't wait to get the Boston bomber incorrect and ruin his life. That would be awesome. Dude, that was, like, such a great thing Reddit did. <laughs> you think it's that easy? Why is he giving daddy energy right now, though? You see that, dude? You see that? I think it's that easy. Mm. Daddy, punish me, you know? He's got that stick. Different music behind the scene gives it, like, totally different vibes. Like, you can totally <laughs> the change. The 80s like generic he's eyeing him music. Up, he the up. ass. He spanked him. <laughs> you think it's that easy? Look at you, this fat butt. <laughs> What? Is it just me or does the snake look fucking dumb? Like, I'm sorry. Like, all of them are like punching and kicking and doing gymnastics. And then the snake's like, I'm gonna just slither around really fast. That's kind of messed up. Just because they're like an amputee and they don't have arms and legs, you're just gonna like <laughs> segregate them like that. But I think they still get a parking spot in this world. Uh oh. Well, that's like show don't, that's like don't show. But t don't tell. That's don't show, don't tell. That's one of the new film techniques. I think you guys are thinking of an implication. I like my expression better. I think that's don't see, don't, don't see. <laughs> You're a disgrace to Kung Fu, and if you have any Jesus respect fucking for who we are and what we do, you will be gone by uh, my <laughs> Fucking bitch. My gosh, she a baddie on God for real on God, mommy. Bro, what I would give her to insult me like that. Just gain like 500 pounds, Corey. That's all you need. <laughs> it's just that easy. You know, in like the big cat kingdom that the women are dominant and they like bite the nuts off the like lions and stuff like that when they're horny. What? Oh. Thank God I'm not a fucking lion, dude. I'm trying to get some of that, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I probably sucked more today than anyone. I sucked more nuts today than anyone in the history of kung fu. <laughs> I suck so much and they still don't like me. Now that that's a daddy right there. Shifu is way more of a daddy than this guy. Bro, they were Will fucking Will Will scream. scream. Oh, that what was did so you soy. guys just that say? Was so soy. That what did so you guys soy. just scream? We're soy. Uh, soy. <laughs> We're soy. That what was happened? a moment. <laughs> that was a Reddit moment. We're Redditors. We're Redditors. <laughs> the Wilhelm scream. What is? Oh, was it? Was it the generic scream sound effect played? If you were a true redditor, you would know that. But <laughs> clearly, you're not. <laughs> That POV shot, man, that was like POV me trying to climb out of the jail. That POV me trying to climb out of the womb. <laughs> no, this is me and my bros racing to the fucking egg, bro, right now. You're stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I'm stuck. Help him. Oh my god. Oh, Step Po is stuck. Oh my god, that sucks. Sorry, cut that out. What did you say? To apply it in combat. Oh. 
Oh. Whoa. But Whoa. What the fuck? No, I'm Why on his side. Why did he like cream himself? I'm on his side. It was never enough for time. That character looks very furry costume-esque. Like, am I wrong? Furries, let us know down below. Was this movie an awakening point for you? Yes or no? We're just, we're doing research. We're running a basic survey. There's no, no judgment. judgment here. We're just trying to find out. Inner peace. Inner peace. <laughs> inner peas. Inner peas. I put a pack of peas in my I like to shit them out one at a time. It's very satisfying. <laughs> Stop. That is so... That is TMI. Too much. Too much, man. It's very bad news. Ah, uh, sheep. <laughs> there is just news. There is no good or bad. I like how wise he can be because he knows he's on his way out. Like, he can just say all this <laughs> bullshit, and then the pe actual other people have to worry about it, Uguay. You're fucking dying. Shut your big ass up. It was an accident. There are no accidents. He said it. There are no accidents. Wait, you mean I wasn't an accident after all? Or we know for damn well you were an accident. We know <laughs> there was just a hole in the con, bro. We know you were an accident. Until you let go of the illusion of control. Illusion. And I can control. <clears throat> yeah! Where to plant the seed. Hiya! That is no illusion, master. But no matter what you do, that seed will grow to be a peach tree. Dude, this is such an interesting dialogue for a children's movie. This is literally like an introspective argument between two characters and fate versus agency. Like, this is fucking Kung Fu Panda. I watched this as a kid, but this is such an amazing movie to watch as an adult as well. My time has come. You must continue your journey. He dies this early in the movie? Rip bozo, rip bozo. <laughs> editor put like really sad, like children crying sound effect. Master. Master Ugwe. When Ugwe died, I cried, man. I cried. <laughs> You'll never be the dragon warrior unless you lose 500 pounds and brush your teeth. No, Poe discovers his real powers in stand-up. They're trolling. He's trolling. Oh my goodness, that's why he's powerful. Because Ugwe was the master troll, and now he becomes similarly powerful. The power oh. is just how funny you are. <laughs> Bro, this shit's like Sekiro, but for furries. Oh. <gasps> That, you just th thought of the perfect video game. They could sell that game for like $200 a copy and it would still sell out. It would still be the number one game of the year. Well, that's why so many furries are into NFTs because they can afford them. If FromSoft was actually a smart company, they would fucking do that. But yet they make stupid garbage game after garbage yeah, game. Yeah, Elden Ring. Who the fuck asked for that game? Literally, Literally no, one. no one bought it. What if they made like furry c ring instead? Like the, 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 the... Stop it. Get some help. I just thought you might be monkey. He hides his almond cookies on the top shelf. Two seconds later. Oh my god. He's built like that now. <laughs> He's found the motivation. Food. This fat fuck. The message of this movie is like, even when you take the movie's message in the most simple way, it's just like, Poe is this disgusting fat fuck. He's 23 years old. He still lives with his parents. He has like no real ambitions, but it's still a very simple story of like self-improvement and like the possibility to change your situation. Yeah, like any munch like him can achieve like yeah. such great things. But you don't have to lose weight. Like you can stay fat. Well, being fat is objectively funny. So in order to stay funny, which is the most important aspect of a person's personality, he's true. going to have to stay fat. Unironically <laughs> true. Imagine how funny we would be if we were all fat. Dude, we already live in America. Like, that's basically already what's happening in this country, so. Holy shit. Oh my god, that edible just kicked in, Master Shifu. <laughs> Whoa. Probably looked high as hell. Then I am your master. Okay. It looks like he's nodding. Stop. <laughs> Stop ruining every fucking scene of the movie. I think this may be the calmest movie commentary you guys have ever done. I do generally think this is the most, in, like, serious commentary we may have ever made on the channel. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a good movie. Like, what are you going to do, bro? Yeah! So, I don't understand. I don't understand. The other dragon warrior dude. What the fuck is he doing in this entire... Is he just jumping off in the mountains for like three weeks straight while Mr. Kung Fu Panda trains? He's been in a prison for like 80 years. He's, he's probably gonna watch the new Puss in Boots movie. He's getting a fucking slice of pizza. He's gonna eat some shawarma. Like, I, he's living life. He's living my life. I just described my life. You just described your to-do list after this recording. My to-do list tonight? <laughs> Little bro, what the f-
No, did you see that smile? Shifu was having fun. He was having fun with one of his students again, bro. Oh my god, this movie's so beautiful. You think I'm a fool? I know you're not the dragon walker. That's not the voice I expected him to have. Yeah, he's British. It sound it literally just sounds like British Jack Black. A worthy opponent. Our battle will be legendary. This is, he's very less intimidating than I thought. I feel like if he, in real life, he has like a top hat and monocle type villain. Like he's like some quirky, like Monopoly Man-esque person. Oh, my dearest Poe. Oh, you're so fat and obese. This is amazing. I'm sorry, like this fight choreography, the entire premise for this is ridiculously creative. And oh my God, oh my God. Holy shit! Man sees a bridge for the first time. I'm just imagining my head, you just, some guy just seeing a bridge and being like, holy shit, you can <laughs> do that? Wait, you're saying I could get from here to there? <sighs> There's no way this praying mantis is lifting the entire bridge right now. Mantis! <laughs> oh, what the? That. Yo, How he just did the bug be broken. Bro, like that. He, the, the he is roided. He is roided. bro. Behold. Dragon scroll. Dragon. Oh my goodness! It's fu It's a fucking D's nuts joke on it. Dragon. <laughs> Dragon D's nuts. That's but that's what Uguay was a troll. That's what Uguay. That's what I'm saying. Uguay would do that. But that's how he kills Tai Long, dude. He gets him with a fucking D's nuts joke, and then Tai Long just faints. It's a picture of him naked. Nobody was supposed to know about this picture. Dude, it would have been crazy if, like, Uguay just left his nudes on there and just trolled everyone from his stripper past. <laughs> they open the scroll, it's just the troll face picture. <laughs> that would be so funny. But who will stop <laughs> That fucking... <laughs> that looks really funny. <laughs> Me looking into the toilet water before... Knowing what I've done. What does that even mean, <laughs> knowing what I've done? What the fuck do you That's mean by that? That's after you flush your fourth goldfish. It is time for you to continue. Continue your journey without me. I am very proud to have been your master. Is he gonna kill himself? What? Why is he saying that? He's gonna go die fighting Tai Long. He's gonna kill him. He's gonna <laughs> himself on the toilet. He's like, Hold, just, just go ahead. I'll be right behind you. I gotta take a quick piss. The secret ingredient is nothing. panda. Nothing. Huh? You heard me. Nothing. nothing. Oh, so there's no secret ingredient, so there's nothing in the scroll. That's the connection that they're going Hard to make. Hard work. Hard work is the secret ingredient, and Poe is already doing that. I still think it's Panda. It's Panda. Yeah, yeah, because that would explain, like, where's Poe's parents, you know? He cooked them up. He used them in the soup. He slaughtered all the Panda people and uses them till this day. I have come home, master. Where did he develop this British accent? In prison? Master. Was he was he just binging Downton Abbey while he was in the prison or something? He only watched Sherlock. That's the only <laughs> he only watched BBC and that's it. The prison only gave him a VHS of Office UK. And I hate cringe comedy. But when Uguay said otherwise. Uguay said no cap, like this brother is not cooking right now. I was cooking! Jesus. Dude, I don't want Shifu to fucking die, man. Dad, I'm gonna flush you down the toilet! Just like you flush my goldfish. Just like you flush my dreams. Who are you, buddy? I... <laughs> he called them buddy. That's so hilariously condescending. You're a panda. What are you gonna do, big guy? Sit on me? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! He just sat on his face, dude. Some people would pay money for that, okay? And he got that for free. They call him Tai Lung for a reason, bro, because he can hold his breath when he's sitting on his face, bro. Oh, because he's a munch. <laughs> bro, that's no fun, man. You got to play along. No, he's doing the same thing as the chopsticks, but with his legs. It's all the lessons he's learned coming back into the fights. The scroll has given him power. Dude, Tai Long is gonna be so angry when he looks at the blank piece of paper, bro. He's gonna start crying, I think. <laughs> the power of the dragon scroll is mine. It's nothing. No, this is actually kind of fucking sad because the reason that Poe was able to realize the secret ingredient thing is because he has a father and this fucking tiger <laughs> does not have a father. So he would have never <laughs> found that out. You're just a big fat. Panda! Oh, I'm not a big fat panda. I'm the big fat panda. Yeah! Yeah! He's literally him! <laughs> that 
went so fucking hard, man. That was man. an awesome That fucking. went so fucking hard. Skadoosh. 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 He says so hard right now. They're probably like, damn, what was that gust of wind? That shit smelled crazy, man. I gotta... Wait, is the whooshy finger hold just pull my finger? Thanks, Dad. So the moral of the movie is that if you don't have a father, then you... You can't become the dragon warrior. <laughs> damn. You're destined for failure. Master? Master Shifu. He's dead. There's no way he dies, dude. I'll be... They're not gonna end the movie with Master Shifu fucking dying. That would traumatize children, man. Master! Look, he's dead. He's fine. He's chilling. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. If he dies, I'm, I'm gonna be fucking pissed. Shut up, bro. He's dead. I don't remember if he dies or not. I haven't seen this no, movie in 15 years. If he dies, I'm gonna die. Ah! Poe, I'm dying. <laughs> he didn't this say is that. My he... death scene. That is actually not the words coming out of his mouth. You have brought peace to this valley. Shit, man. He's actually gonna die, isn't he? No. It's a fucking kids movie. Dude, he's gonna die. He's actually going to die. Damn, he actually died, bro. What the no, no, fuck? No, don't die, Shifu, please! I'm not dying, you- Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. Jesus bro, Christ. I feel like, like, Eden, you're giving, like, genuine, like, 12-year-old in the theater watching this movie I don't know, dude. I'm just very- I'm just very <laughs> emotionally- Shifu, no! I'm very emotionally invested in this movie right now. Yes, they're playing Kung Fu fighting. CeeLo Green sings Kung Fu. Did you see that? CeeLo Green. What? I did see that. That's that is very crazy. of the time. Like, that is extremely of the time. I, okay, I genuinely have this question. What is it with animated movies and having to have, like, the shittiest pop artist cover of a song at the end of every movie? Everything. Like, all the Disney movies. This is awesome! Shut your fucking bitch ass up. Hear the legends of the Kung Fu Panda! I'm pretty sure Jack Black, he doesn't play Pooh. <laughs> Pooh. Bro said Pooh, dude. Yeah, he sings the theme song, yes. Which is fire. Well, it's fucking Jack Black. He's the greatest singer of our goddamn generation, dude. Tenacious D? This is just a Tenacious D song. He lives and he trains and he fights. Oh my god, it's goaded. It's actually fucking fire. This is the only thing I remember about the show. Because I used to watch this. It would come on like YTV a lot. But like, I think I would just skip the channel after the theme song. Like, it would just... Wait, have you guys both seen this show before? Everyone's seen this show before. What are you talking about? Fu, can we take five so I can go sterilize my beak with hot coals? I think I cut Tigress is cold. Oh, oh God. It's hard to compete with Jack Black, I get it, but it's gonna take me a second, okay? Why is chat saying Alistair from Hasbin Hotel? No, I think he voices one of the characters. Maybe Crane. No way. So Crane is Jesus Christ. <laughs> Not cool, man. Seth Rogen. I like we get to hear two different Seth Rogen impersonators. Impersonator is such an extreme term to use for someone <laughs> just playing the same character. That's who I'm gonna invite to my next birthday party. I'm gonna get some Seth Rogen impersonators to come. What's the big deal about River Fever? You get a little sneezy, a little snoozy. This show looks better than the Megamind show. Yeah, a lot better. It's like animated, like the characters move around and stuff. It came out a decade before the Megamind show, and it looks incredibly better. The Valley of the Scorpion. No one's risking their lives for me. I'll be fine. Fine? It looks like Poe has like a coke problem. Like there's something up with his eyes. Like It's kind of weird. Well, they need some running dramatic plot. It looks like the dragon warrior is going to be picking up that orchid dealy. 50 points says I get there before you. There's something like weird about it. Like they're just kind of chilling. It feels like I'm watching like a Kung Fu Panda role play session. They're all acting like children right now. They didn't act like this in the movie at all. She used this new power to control others. This is awesome, dude. That they, they, they held up the 2D animation from the movie. Pick up the pace. Me. You couldn't pick up the pace with a shovel. You couldn't pick up the pace with a shovel? You don't use a shovel to pick things up. Has Monkey used a shovel before? To be fair, like, monkeys don't use tools, so he's probably, like, just, like, he's just guessing. So maybe that's the joke, is that, like, he doesn't know what a shovel does. They need my orchid, and I need to add something to my collection of just why is she kind of cute though? She's kind of like old lady with 40 cats, you know what I mean? Yeah, she has such a friendly, like, nice old lady sounding voice. Hmm? Hmm?
I sure hope a scorpion doesn't come out. This show is so much better animated than like any other movie to TV show. Just already, like all the character animation and stuff like that. And so much sexier characters too. As you destroy Shifu's little pet, the dragon warrior. No! The fact that his like hair is like unrendered, he kind of looks like a big piece of popcorn. Yeah, he's like a little bit burnt popcorn with a lot of butter on it. Mm. I must destroy the panda. Maybe this is a better, cause Monkey was saying a bunch of shitty jokes roasting Poe earlier. Maybe it's better that his brain is gone in the show. So he stops like telling Poe to pick up a shovel or something. Maybe he knows what a shovel is now. Cause like the brain chemistry has been rewired. Are you messing with my head? Ooh, a berry. Okay, I haven't watched this show since I was like eight years old probably, but I have a feeling that this this trope of like the Furious Five turning against them is probably very common. It's bird poop. Ow, ew! I just touched bird poop. I just touched bird poop. <laughs> that was the gayest <laughs> Poe has ever said. <laughs> uh, we also took in some kids with river fever. Hope you don't mind. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I had a crush on the lion as a kid. The lion, really? Where, where is it? <laughs> Her name is Tigress, bro. How the fuck did you just say the lion? <laughs> the lion. <laughs> the bro said the lion. What are you trying to do? Destroy Poe. RN. He's the Texas government. He's a Republican. Monkey, 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 monkey. Are you messing with my head? It's like, this is like a Looney Tunes sequence. These shows were created to air right before Spongebob. They're not that bad that you're going to turn off the channel. This show comes on and you're like, okay, I'll watch it. Spongebob's airing next. This show's like, you know, the flour mixed in with the cocaine. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. The fentanyl mixed in with the cocaine. Like, you just have to deal with it sometimes. Can we do your hair and makeup? Is that a Scottish voice? A Scot- that was a child. Can a child not be Scottish? We act like these are exclusive things. <laughs> God, uh, uh. Friends, remember? This show, okay, like we can't, we can't, we can't keep doing this to us, okay? <laughs> the amount of kid brain that we've been watching lately, it is damaging my brain. It is legitimately damaging my brain. I, I am stunting my development as an adult. That was one of the most bodacious moments I've ever seen in the Kung Fu Panda franchise. I thought it was pretty tenacious of him. I'm surprised that he hasn't skadooshed yet. I feel like my, I'm, I've been. They only get one skadoosh a season. Wait, how many seasons does this show have? 20, it's still going. It's like Grey's Anatomy. They just like never cancel it. <laughs> they forgot to cancel it. There's no time. Oh. Oh. Tigress this whole episode is gonna be me after finishing watching the show. Like actually, I'm gonna lie down in bed trying to recover my brain. I think the funny is thing is that so many of my compliments for it are like it's not doing something that's like overtly terrible. Yeah, it's not the monster versus alien show. Kung Fu Panda. This is the best part of the show. Do you get what I mean when I turn this shit off after the theme song, bro? Like, yeah, because you knew you already got Pete. Legends of awesomeness. Sweet. Sweet! <laughs> <laughs> the princess in the pole, bro. Oh my god, this episode about to be peak. You have to get Princess Mei Li safely to the king of the Chidon. And I am perfect for this gig. Because if there's one thing I love, it's kids. <laughs> <laughs> Was Poe part of Dream SMP? Do not touch the royal silk. Peppa Pig! Peppa Pig royalty! Oh, these are the kids that, like, get the British accents for watching too much Peppa Pig. That brat with the crown is our next target. Let's go! Move it, move it, move it! I, I like, like to move, move it, move it. it. That was a Julian reference! Nice! With how annoying King Julian is and Penguin's just shoving himself into the plot. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if he just found a way to force himself into this show. <laughs> There's just a crossover episode with King Julian. Please, please make it happen. Hello, Po. How are you doing? For it is the destiny of we the strong to conquer they the weak. My John DiMaggio. Oh, it is. Can he fucking fuck off? Like, uh, legitimately, I feel like John DiMaggio is in like 90% of what we watch. You don't look like a clown, Poe. You look like a lady. Oh, that's so scary. Man, this is misogynistic, dude. That's crazy. I love that shit. I mean, I don't love it. I'll have you beheaded. I'll have all of you beheaded. 
I like how she keeps like talking about beheading people. You know, this show has some edge. It actually does have some edge. If it was made today, like Bluey doesn't say that shit. Bluey doesn't say, I'm gonna behead you for all that. Like she doesn't say that, so. I'll handle the clown. This is what happens when you stop to get gas in a small town in Florida. In fact, don't stop in Florida. Just don't go. They're gonna come and siphon out your gas from your car, bro. It's over. What are you doing? Dog fight. I want fried rice balls stuffed with sweet bean paste. She said stop fighting. Motherfucker, she he is literally saving your life. They're trying to assassinate her and she says stop fighting. I'm hungry. Dude, I love her. She's really funny. All that remains is a single jug of water. My crown was dusty. I'm thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> the show got some good ones. She is so fucking based, dude. I actually like respect her so much for that. You let the bandits get away. You dumped out the last of our water and you picked on my friend. He's so angry. He looks evil. He looks scary. This is the most pissed off Poe has been in the entire franchise. He looked actually so evil. The shading made him look so evil in that shot. And I tried, that is the panda tried hard and, and told his friends that he could get you to like me i mean her him her like him oh my me, me messing up someone's pronouns bro like her him hum her her him <laughs> i was just trying and well the moral of the story is dude the soundtrack is actually like decent my standards for music in children's shows are so low and this is actually like trying you know i take it back i was like this show is like the old thing you watch before spongebob but it's like maybe it still is that but you know it's it's okay you think I don't know nobody likes me? I try and behead everyone. Of course nobody likes me, bro. Like, what? <laughs> Go ahead and knock. You think they have any fried rice balls stuffed with bean paste? Childhood obesity is crazy. Is, is that child obese because she's a pig and all pigs are obese, right? Like most of them? Well, actually, pigs on average have a lower body fat percentage than women. I learned that fact from Silver Spoon. You learned that fact from fucking Andrew Tate, bro. Shut the hell up. <laughs> <laughs> it's true, bro. What are you saying? Queens ain't fat at all, bro. Every few years, the king is given a new princess. And they're doing the 2D animation again. This is cool. This show's like... Got a budget. It feels like they're actually trying to recapture like what made the movie fun and cool. My new servant. <gasps> what? Child slavery, bro. I feel like there's a lot of cartoons that have child slavery. Yeah, because it's it's such a constant thing in our actual world that kids got to learn about it young. Huh? Uh, I won't let you risk your lives for me. King of the Chidon. I will be your child bride. <laughs> what? Is she gonna be a child bride? Is that what's happening? I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> child brides in the Kung Fu Panda show would be crazy. Well, we're allowed child slavery, but not child brides. Like, I think they're pretty equal. Put her in chains! Oh my god, her name is Alice. Her name's Alice, right? They're putting Alice in chains. Oh my god, the famous band. That's a reference. Is her name Alice? Like, is her name Alice? It's Mei Lin, I think. But that translates to Alice in English. Well, it's like how every Chinese student at a college has a Chinese name and the professor tries to say it terribly and they're like, just call me Joe. Princess style. What's he gonna do, behead him? <laughs> he rips his head off. Oh my God. I mean, he literally grabbed the bull by the horns, right? Well, by the ears. It looks like he's about to rip his ears off. Like it's actually kind of grotesque. That's a wild face. That's a wild face. Whoa. It's like smushed his entire face. So, we can leave with the princess and you'll keep your promise of peace, right? Yes. How long are we gonna hold on this shot? It looks so gross. This is just embarrassing. What? <laughs> the knowing look at each other. You ready to end this episode? We're about to kill these motherfuckers. Me, me and my bro beating up a minority. Like, what the fuck was that? That guy wasn't even gonna do anything to Poe. They just beat him up for no reason. Legends of awesomeness. Sweet! sweet! How do you not say <laughs> sweet? It's like, if I don't say it, I'm going to blow up. Need a few bean paste dumplings, a liberal portion of honey. Liberal portion, okay. <laughs> a conservative portion of dumplings? He's not conservative. Poe is fat. Poe is fat. Poe is fat. He is fat. He is fat. He is fat. He is fat. I would like the dragon warrior. Yes? 
to clean the entire training hall. <laughs> you know how like in between the first and second movie when we watched him on the channel, we were like, what happened to Poe? Like what happened to his character development? Like how did he regress? I thought that he grew so much over the course of the first movie. This is what happened. The show is canon, I'm telling you. The more time he has to himself, the dumber he gradually becomes. I hope you're happy, Sticky Dumpling. This is all your fault. This cannot possibly be a 20 minute episode about sticky dumplings. I'm not going to lie. I'm pretty sure this, this entire episode is about to take place in this one room. And I don't know if I have the strength for it. <laughs> With no other characters. It's just Poe talking to himself the entire time. Oh, we made it out. We made it out. Oh my God. We made it out the hood. We did it. Whoa, that is so- That is so, huh? Sweet! Sweet! Ugh. Now die? Dad, it's for you. Who is this kid? He does not- That does not look like a Kung Fu Panda character. That looks like a Zoomer. That looks like a fucking kid from my pin- Pin jar, Jartner's a monkey. What? You want to try again? That looks like a kid from my gym partner's a monkey. That looks like a kid from my gym. I'd be working out with warthogs, bro. Me and Pumbaa on the- on the deadlift, like. But I was never as good as Shifu. Dude, this is more stylistic than anything in Adventure Time. Sweet! But you know, you know the Candy Kingdom, right? If you had one word to describe the Candy Kingdom, Jack. <laughs> Genocidal, bro. That's the one. That's the one word I would use. Well, I have news for you. Kung Fu is sweet. <laughs> that was the last one. That was the last one. That was the last one. They'll turn their backs on Kung Fu and worship me like a god. Wait, what is he yapping about? I have no idea what he's talking about now. He said, worship me like a god. He's trying to do eugenics or something. I don't know. I will soon destroy all who once opposed me. <laughs> Wait, this guy, this guy voices in Toy Story. He voices um Rex, this guy. Like Tyrannosaurus Rex. Dinosaur King is what you want to be, yeah. Well, yeah, because the past is in the present. And time is twisted upside down. These fossils are colossal. Sweet, 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 sweet. We have watched too much children's media. It's melting our brains. It's melting our brains. We can't. We have to stop. <laughs> Mega mind, monsters, aliens. I can't do this anymore, man. We're adults. It's over, man. What are you doing? Ah. Uh, Okay, we have to take the show seriously, okay? This can't be the last third of the video. You can't say this as Poe's ass is taking up the entire screen. Statistically speaking, if people watch the first half of the video, they watch the whole thing regardless. So we can do whatever we want. We can do anything. Well, you can't, we can't just do anything. Let me grab my dildo, give me a sec. <laughs> oh, that's a terrible idea. Uh, you know what you should do? I feel like the Poe voice actor for this show, you can't beat Jack Black, but he's great. Grown on me. Like a malignant tumor, this show has really grown on me. And, uh, you know, it's it's kind of good. Is malignant the bad one? Yeah. I'm sorry about that. I am going in there. Why? Because you're scared of me? Okay, I am actually curious. Do they do more with, like, the Tigress Poe romance stuff? Because it always felt like they, like, were about to do that, but they never actually commit in the movies. Maybe in one of the three seasons of this show, they go on a date. Poe's the type of guy to undo the bra and go... Sweet! He's gonna sk skadoosh the bra off, dude. <laughs> Sweet! Oh my god, I'm literally gonna fucking kill myself. What would happen if you're having a totally normal relation with another person and you say skadoosh when you come? Uh, well, I feel like we ought to find out somehow. One brave soldier has to try it out, you know? This episode doesn't have a B plot. Yeah, Tigress needs to get sick again. Achoo! They should use the plan B on this episode, bro. Abort this shit. Machinery will never be more powerful because it has no heart. That's not true. AI is about to take over Shifu. This did not age well. Yeah, but he lives in ancient China. How is he supposed to know about that? China has more advanced AI than we'll ever dream of, dude. Fuck, you can beat me with Part of this is just that there's a lot of action sequences and they're not bad or anything. It's just like action is kind of like too much of it is boring. I agree with you, but I feel like that's actually an unpopular opinion because most people just like action. I mean, especially like the young boys that this show is for. It's probably cool as fuck. Sorry for uh, everything. Well, I don't know about everything, but... 
What? What a horrible way to apologize to someone. Hey, he's not apologizing for making those fire ass dumplings, bro. Cause those should those should save the day, you know what I mean? Yeah, I know this is random, but yesterday I I made a quesadillas with cheese that expired three months ago and like holy shit man i just don't feel good right now i'm gonna be honest <laughs> three months dude it's probably placebo you'll be fine this is where dreams come true and our dream to watch kung fu panda it's master Uguay. i see Uguay is above does Uguay rise dream after three days in this two. movie just like jesus because we're watching this mo movie on easter day but their son lord shen this is super cool. I love the style, like the the 2D puppet animation style. I thought it was gonna be the same as last time, but it's like it's really interesting. We sealed it. So Poe's people got genocided, yes. and that's why he's being raised by a, a a mongoose fella. Search the farthest villages. Find more metal. You've got a mind for ore, dude. You got a mind for ore. Yes. You monster! Keep going! Hit 40! He'll never hit 40! <laughs> He'll never hit 40. Do it. No problem! Oh, Tigris is his motivating factor, dude. He's trying to prove to Tigris that he's a munch. But is that gonna come back later in the movie? He, like, has to eat the villain whole? Like, that's, this is a challenge. It's like a bird. He, like, fries up the, the <laughs> bird on, like, a, on a fucking pan. Get that chicken going, bro. Master Shifu! <sighs> Master Shifu, what do we got? Pirates? Chalupas? Of Did you get the Mexican pizza? I heard it was pretty good. Crunch wrap? Did we get any crunch wrap? What are you doing? One of Master Uguay's final teachings. Shutting the fuck up, Poe. You ever try it? It's his final <laughs> teaching where you shut <laughs> your bitch ass up. It's one of the hardest things up. to learn. You, you, the waterbed? Fushigi! I always wanted a Fushigi, dude. Poe, the day you were chosen as Dragon Warrior was the worst day of my life. Dude, this guy, is, <laughs> he's chilled out so much that was hilarious. since the last movie. Get all the metal you can find! Who are- why are these- okay, so they're trying to get metal so they can make something to kill the dragon warrior or something? <laughs> hey, yo. Oh my god. Dude, it's so satisfying him watching watch him like slap his blubber against another person. It's so fun. I don't know, man. As 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 like a skinny fella, you know what I mean? I just feel like kind of just like who am I supposed to relate to? In the this mantis, movie, you know what bro. I mean? Look at it. That's literally you. You're the Seth skinny. Rogen. Seth Rogen is my skinny king. No, he yeah. isn't. Okay. Well, Have you ever seen a picture of Seth Rogen? Seth Rogen is a skinny legend nowadays. You have to accept that. Oh my god, what the fuck? This looks so Whoa. cool. Oh my god, what the fuck? So if I want to see like the Poe training arc, do I have to like read the comics or something? Like when did he get so OP? Like, is there, watch, like a I, I think I like maybe the last movie that we watched. Is everyone okay? Is everyone okay? Please touch my belly if you want to feel happiness. It's the only way to the top. What? Flashback. Anime? 2D animation anime. flashback. You oh know my god, his mother was in 2D animation. Dad, can I talk to you? <laughs> of course. So this is the first time I'm ever questioning you being my father, even though I am six times the size of you. Where did I come from? Your mother's p You see, when a duck and a panda love each other very much. What if that was the plot twist? Like, you, he was the father. Adopted. I knew it. You knew? Well, who told you? No one. I mean, come on, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> this is such a real scene. Just a very child Poe. Not gonna say it though. Oh my god, the child Poe looks so cute, Aaron. Don't say that, man. Don't <laughs> say that. I had to. It was so cute. <laughs> well, you didn't even do it right, so. You know what I want? You. Your story may not have such a happy beginning. It won't have a happy ending either, because you're gonna die eventually. And who am I? You're Poe, bro. You're oh. Poe. What? <laughs> what were you going to say? <laughs> 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 Who am say? I? Oh, you're the main character. I wasn't going to say anything. I was going to say he's Poe at this current moment in time. <laughs> this is very interesting that a fucking peacock is the villain of this movie. Gongman City. Another British. Can we talk about how the second villain is also British? That's what I was saying in the last movie. If you want to make someone evil, give them a European accent. But they're specifically going after the British. Do you think like Winston Churchill is going to be the third villain in Kung Fu? Yes. No. Three? Winston Overwatch is going to pop out of the side of the screen and start going. Oh, 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 oh. 
Just move to the side, bro. Just move to the side. Bro, Why this would is you... so inefficient. If you're trying to destroy China, if you're trying to take over, just introduce opium. Like that's the that's the go-to strategy. How is he still fat? I don't. Does he have like? Is he just like super strong, but has like zero stamina? He's one of those like gym bros <laughs> that, that like is gigantic. No cardio ever. That Dude, is this is like the fucking One Piece character gonna... pulling up to Arlong <laughs> Park. I tried so hard not to say that. I tried. So hard. <laughs> I kept that in. Yo, this shit goes crazy this movie though. Is like fucking awesome. Oh my god, that last shot was insane. <laughs> the rat. Oh my god. Holy shit. Power scale that, Shonen community. Why is this the coolest action scene in the movie? It's a po fighting a radish. <laughs> what the fuck was that? I used to punch the ironwood trees by the palace to train. Now I feel nothing. <laughs> she punches trees. She used to punch trees. She was just a fucking Minecraft kid. And I envisioned it. I would love to see this woman's hands on her knees. I'm not gonna lie. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter whether it's a woman or a man. I don't know which one it is. It's a man. This is a man? I thought this was a woman the whole time. What? There's no way this is a man. How? If you continue on your current path. That sounds like fucking Ronnie from Elden Ring, bro. This way, tarnished. May I have a word? Big and furry. Soft and squishy. Ugh, kind of plush and cuddly. It sounds like he likes him. He's describing him in such adorable <laughs> ways. <laughs> One tandem lives. That does not make you right. You see, now now he sounds like a girl. You know what I'm saying? No. Like, not that, that not, I'm not saying that, like, Ow. <laughs> Hello. I couldn't help it anymore. Yeah, okay. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I really like the delivery of that. He's played like half of an Assassin's Creed game. That's basically his entire experience. He fails the fucking trailing missions. Like the easiest missions where you just follow someone slowly. But he's, he's too impatient. He always goes right up to the guy and keeps wondering, why do I keep losing this mission, dude? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god, what the fuck? We're gonna free you from those bonds of injustice. No problem. Gotta be a key around here. No, they wouldn't leave a key around here. Yes! Did the mic just pee? Yeah, it, it peaked did. really it hard. Did, did you guys hear that? That was like some horrible audio. That's quality. her superpower. Like she clips the audio so hard that it like breaks anything in front of her. Kung Fu is dead. What? Everybody wasn't Kung Fu fighting. My fist and your plush cuddly, super soft face. But he is like yeah, flirting he... with them. <laughs> Yeah, dude, the action, the way the action flows in these movies is like, it, it's so great. Oh my goodness. And then he's going to have to eat all the children. Yeah. Who's oh my what? God. She no slapped way. his ass. No she way. She slapped his ass. Dude, he's going to be a villain turned good guy. That's why they're setting him up this way. Better bring a whole lot. Never mind. They're fucked. Never They're mind. Fucked. They're, They're fucked. fucked immediately. Eight point acupressure cuffs, just like the ones that held Tai Lung. The more you move, the tighter they get. Bro, he's <laughs> he's geeking out even while being locked up. He's coming to me in chains. If anyone should be afraid, it's you. No flipping away. Is this like the Jesser? Like, why is this the one person that just has to tell the peacock like whatever is on their mind? He's walking so slowly up there. Dude, the stairs. this sounds so gross. This sounds This is the so Redditor gross. leaving his basement for the first time. Like what what is happening? Thanks for carrying me. Those last few flights. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> they had to carry him. Even though he's a fucking prisoner. They didn't even do that for my boy Jesus carrying the cross, man. Stand aside, sir. That's a lady. Oh, sorry. The beard threw me. It's kind of misleading. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I can think of that in a very lives. different context. That's all I'm gonna say. A lifetime? Whoa, 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 whoa! I did not have a lifetime. We only heard about Master Rhino a few days ago, and we came to avenge him. I'm gonna be straight up. Like looking at that peacock is kind of making me hungry. Like he looks, <laughs> he looks delicious. I'm not gonna lie. And then the lady over here, I think it's a guy. He's got a. Whoa! Did he kill the pandas? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you not watch the? Did they already of the say film? that? Yeah, the that was the beginning. That was of the literally the beginning of the movie. Oh That's his entire God. backstory. Is oh that he uh, he killed? God, he, I hate this. What Kung Fu Panda Two is way too confusing. If man. only, if only we could pay attention at the beginning. And that's why he's being raised by a, a, a mongoose fella. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> the laughing animations are kind of weird. Yeah, like, weird. they look high as fuck, dude. They look like completely greened out. Anime! Oh my god, anime moment. Motherless behavior. That's why you're not gonna win. You're motherless, and I see through your motherless behavior. This Dang. is like the second round of the boss fight when he just goes to a different area. This is this is phase two of the boss fight. Oh, that looks cool as fuck. I'm not gonna lie, if there was like a mod for Sekiro where you played as Kung Fu Panda instead, I feel like the game would be a hundred times better. Dog, this shit is fucking insane right now. There's the building is falling. They're getting shot by arrows. They're crashing into the village. They're Fortnite landing. So much shit is happening. And they don't take fall damage. And they don't take fall damage. No fall damage is crazy. Wait! I have to go back. Did she just quit? <laughs> Tigress, no! Oh my god, she gave him a hug. I'll be your mommy, Poe, okay? I promise I won't quit this time. No more quit jokes, chat. I'm not gonna ruin any more scenes in the movie, I promise. My parents hated me. Oh my goodness, it's it's a parallel. Cause he had he had mommy and daddy issues too. So we slaughtered an entire race of people. I understand. Sononawa! The cycle of genocide, bro, it never ends. It never and then Poe's gonna have to do genocide. Poe's just doing a genocide on the duck people by eating all their food. Yes, I was there. Yes, I watched as your parents abandoned you. <laughs> <laughs> That's so crazy to say in a kid's movie. That is insane. Well, it's like they're trying to give something for like the children watching this movie to relate to. Yeah, because their parents are going to leave them in the theater. Jesus Christ, Jack. Can you imagine that there was probably at least one child that walked into this movie with their parents and then never saw them again after this? That child was me. <laughs> Cor, I'm so sorry, man. That's funny as hell. <laughs> Toy Story, no! <laughs> I was literally thinking the same thing. Toy Story 3, no! Oh, he's finally hitting the treadmill. He's finally gonna lose some weight, Poe. Jesus Christ. This is like a good weight loss strategy, though. Like, if you have a giant pool of lava and then the treadmill in front of it, so if you fuck up, you die instantly. Your parents didn't love you. He's talking so sensually. Stop breathing so hard, bro. You moved for like five minutes. There's no way you're that tired, dude. Your parents didn't love you. <sighs> Master Shifu knew he fucking dying. Dude, Master Shifu, why aren't you helping them, bro? Dude, he's chilling. He's on defense. He's smoking the blunt, bro. <laughs> he's high as fuck right now. He took that edible and woke up after like three days. Child this Poe. Is, this is fucking adorable. This I didn't know how much child Poe there was in this movie. Maybe I wouldn't have watched it if I knew there was so much child Poe. Oh my god, this is so sad. Dude, when I watched the first movie, I didn't know Poe no. had so much fucking trauma, holy bro. Like, shit. holy shit. But the pandas fought back. That's not what we saw. These pandas are fucking... The transitions are so cool. This scene is so great. What the hell? <gasps> but no, it's CGI. What the fuck? That was so fucking sick. I'm gonna... Ah! Oh, she looks so much uglier in CGI. Take me back, man. Take me back. <laughs> no, this is sad. No, what the fuck, man? Why is that facial expression so real? No, she's gonna fucking die. She may, oh. Are they gonna animate her getting shot or something? Oh my, oh my oh god. My god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my no. god. They killed her right there. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. This is a sad Poe RN. I'm sorry. Well, sometimes it's better when it's sad. I don't know. You get your whole, like, emotions involved in it. Who you choose to be. The bro. dad is like literally the best character in the entire movie, two movies in a row, bro. Literally, like all of Poe's problems could be solved if he just realized how good of a father he already has. Support your local restaurants, small, locally owned businesses. They're the true heroes of our world. I am Poe. That's hard. <laughs> yeah. I am Poe. I never thought I'd die like this. I always thought I'd meet a nice girl and settle down, and then she'd eat my head. <laughs> <laughs> he 
he said it. That's like his goal. That's like the only joke he has is that the, the mantises like kill each other during sex. <laughs> yeah, I guess getting head has a very different meaning for a praying mantis. Is that where it came from? Did humans get that term from watching mantises go at it? <laughs> is that a typical human activity? Oh my fucking god. Yo! That is the most badass frame in any fucking DreamWorks movie. It was not that bad. Yes, it was. It is not that I was You were just, gassing no, it up I am way not. too he much. He was standing was right hard. there. It's a panda in a hat, man. It's a panda in a fucking hat. It went hard. It went hard. It was awesome. Disc of destruction. <laughs> what the fuck is this scene? What, what just happened? I, I like that the, the framing of Poe is like, he's both like a nerd who sucks and super powerful. You know, he he really has it's his cake so and eats it and then eats another cake. Because he's a fat piece of shit that I love a lot. <laughs> I like this guy. He just gets like anxiety and stops being confident because if he stayed confident. Yeah, he just has performance issues. But don't we all, you know what I mean? When it's your first time, you get a little nervous and you just don't perform the way you were expecting. <laughs> Master Ox, tell Wait, this is bullshit. The second that like Poe started winning, they just showed up to get some glory. Like, what the fuck? Master Shifu! Like, none of these motherfuckers were gonna help, and then all of a sudden Poe and Shifu show up, so they're like, yeah, I guess we can <laughs> sneak in at the very end to get some credit. Yeah. Why aren't we firing? They're taking out our gunner, sir. They're getting close. Why does he have to ask that? Is he like blind? They're fighting 10 feet in front of him right now. <laughs> I have very poor eyesight. I need corrective lenses ASAP. Oh my God, that's the Titanic. Titanic, Tigris, hold on. <laughs> Wait, who's gonna die, Tigress or Poe? Well, Tigress is definitely the man in the relationship, so I think that she should die. <laughs> James Cameron ain't got nothing on this movie. Well, in the Titanic, they had to film it in a giant pool because they like the CGI wasn't that advanced yet. Here, they didn't have to go in a giant pool, so they win. You know what I mean? Poe didn't even have to get wet. He didn't even do it in real life. Poe po can't get wet? No, he's a guy, dude. Guys don't get wet. You gotta use loop. No, Poe's gonna die! No! No, he's not. He's using the way of the water. He's using the way of the water. He's inner peace. Inner peace isn't gonna stop a bullet to the chest, Poe. He just caught a bullet. Like, what the fuck? That's insane. What? His hand is on fire? Oh, oh, that wasn't intentional. <laughs> Good thing he's surrounded by water. If only he put it in the water. Nope, he put it in his mouth. Wow. Oh, and see, that comes back because remember how big his mouth is? He could fit his whole hand in his mouth. Can wow. you fit your whole hand in, him, in your mouth? I don't think so. I can fit my whole hand somewhere else. <laughs> Dude, literally, like, this is the most OP we've seen Poe yet. Like, this is fucking insane. What the fuck is he gonna do in the third movie? He's literally reflecting <laughs> bullets. He's gonna get, like, ultra instinct in the third movie. He's gonna become fucking god. Demon Slayer fucking pales in comparison to this shit. Yo, it's like yin and yang. Skadoosh. He said it! No! Oh my god, he said skadooch. He killed people. Poe is a murderer. Just like the dude who killed his race. This guy killed your mother so you kill him. The cycle of revenge continues. The only thing that matters is what you choose to be now. Damn, that's deep as hell. But you should still be arrested for life. Whoa. What? He was totally chill with just dying there, but why? I mean, he lost. What do you think they were going to do to him after he gets caught? You think he's going to get like a noble, like he's going to get left free? He literally genocided people. <clears throat> That's it, a hug. They should have been married. They should have been married, but the liberals took it away from us. Did you save China? Yep. Well, I knew you would. 
That's why I had new signs made. Yo. Whoa. They should have used that as the poster for the movie. Propaganda. That's prop po propaganda. Po propaganda, man. Po propaganda. Look, all I'm saying is if if Poe was leading the CCP, it's a, it'd be a very different story. I'm your son. No, I'm your son. yes. I'm your son. Yes. No. Yes. This is like fuck Pixar dads. Fuck Pixar dads, okay? I would like to, but... No, Cora, you ruined my... Cora, shut up. <laughs> oh my god, what the F? What the fuck? No, but there's pandas. There's fucking pandas. The pandas are still alive. There's no way. There's simply no way. No, I remember, because in the theater, I remember this happened. If the pandas are still alive, I'm going to be pissed. Wait, this is literally just the same as How to Train Your Dragon. It's literally How to Train Your Dragon. But look, the pandas alive. I fucking knew it. My son is alive. Wait, was That's that Brian Cranston? Cranston? <laughs> Brian Bra Breaking Brad is pro's dad? What the fuck? Walter! Walter Black and White. Wait, so does Master Ugwe come back to life in the third movie? I think he's uh in Nirvana or whatever. Are they gonna pull it? Someone's pulling him out of Nirvana? Out of his inner peace? Master Ugwe. Who the fuck is this guy? Our battle ended 500 years ago. How old is Master Ugwe? Like Those sea turtles do live for a very long time. Yeah, they live a long time. And also, he's Chinese, and Chinese people live longer too. So Shit. think about it. He could be like a billion years old. He's the ultimate being, dude. Dude, he hit him with a kanji, dude. That shit must have been heavy as hell. But was it the right stroke order? It was never my destiny to stop you. I have set another on that path. What? Ugwe dies again? He died again? How many Bro. times does Ugwe need Mother to fucking die? This ain't no Dragon Ball. You don't have to kill him like 80 times. You guys aren't doing the dramatic pose, are you? To be honest, it looks a little skinnier than the last movie. Dude, you're just trying to be nice. You're just trying to be nice, man. Like me teach? I mean, why not Tigress? She's always telling everyone what to do. Be quiet, Poe. You see what I mean? Tigress? I feel like I remember Tigress a lot because as a kid, I had a Tigress toy from McDonald's. So I always thought that like she was cool. <laughs> but she's like barely in the movie, if we're being honest. Like I wish that they would do more with like the supporting cast around Poe. Yo, what did you do with it, Eden? The fucking toy? Well, it's sitting in a jar back home and it's marinating like I don't like what's wrong with that like did you at least learn a little something yes that you can't teach I mean that this is literally just true just because you're good at doing something yeah, doesn't mean you're good at teaching it like that's just a fact but Poe has to learn to be a teacher in this because he's gonna be the next master when Shifu fucking dies of heart disease in this episode Shifu eats a lot of Taco Bell and it's not very good for his health I'm not trying to turn you into me I'm trying to turn you into you. That's bars. He's just trying to like pass on his work so he doesn't have to do it. That's true. Like just, I wish Shifu would be more honest in this movie. It's called retirement. <laughs> yeah, you shouldn't fucking retire. Work till you're dead, bro. That's what I'm doing. Yeah, if this movie took place in Japan, he, Shifu would be working till the day he dropped, man. That's the problem. <laughs> that's, that's just the cultural difference, I guess. Out of all the villains, the design is stupid. He looks uh, lame. He looks like a bad piggy from fucking Angry Birds. The most threatening villain of all time. The mortal realm. You hear that, Ugwe? I'm back. Wait, he just returned? For, he was in, like, the afterlife? Yeah, for 500 years. He just pulled up. Bro, you know who this guy looks like? He looks like that guy from One Piece. Kaido? Kaido. He looks like Kaido. Kaido when he was, like, 15, bro. So he has little zombie versions of these ugly masters? That's disgusting. They're like little homunculuses made out of his own cum or something. Ew. They look like they're made out of boogers. They are made out of boogers, Cor. That's my secret. And that's why it took me 500 years. I needed to create enough mucus to mold a model of every single one of the previous masters. They're made out of jade? Shut the fuck up, bro. Oh no! It's the dragon teacher! Yeah, he's so handsome! Thank you for the compliment. What the? He still has action figures. They're his students at this point. Like, now it's just weird, man. That's weird. That's really weird. Like, there's, like, a power dynamic here, and I feel like Poe's gonna get in trouble for abusing it, bro. That's all I'm saying. Who's paying for them? What? Oh, my God. Is that a, another Poe? Is that adult Poe? Oh. That's dad Poe. That's breaking bad Poe. Son, 
<gasps> oh my gosh, it is you! Why are you alive, though? That's what pisses me off. You should be dead. You're invalidating my experiences of the last movie. Like bro, we literally cried watching Kung Fu Panda 2, and you're gonna be alive? Like, what the hell? They just cut Poe's real dad. The man who raised him is getting, like, familiarly cut right now. Can you think about that? I'm pretty sure he said his name is Lee. You come here. <laughs> Is the plot going to be that Poe's dad is only coming into his life because he's rich and famous now and he's going to like profit off of his riches? He's actually a piece of shit. He's a piece of shit, dad. Oh my, that would be awesome. That honestly sounds like that could be what this movie is about. How could you receive a message if no one could find you? It was a message from the universe. What the fuck is a sign from the universe? Did God text his phone? Yes, dude. Once you truly believe in the spirit of Christ and that God loves you, you will be able to understand jack but until you welcome god into your heart like i don't know what to tell you it doesn't have to be your heart though it could be other places yeah god could enter any part of your body just ask mary that's what i learned from the priest some kind of jade zombies jade zombies yeah. zombies jade Oh, oh what? Wow. What? wow. Zombies. Wow. Jump? Wow. That's not even a wow. joke. Oh, that's a groaner right there, baby. Jackie Chan, pack it up. <laughs> it's me talking through that. Kai. Who? Okay, okay, okay. Kai Sinna. Biggest streamer ever? Hello? Who is that, bro? I watched Ludwig, man. I don't know. I was an ambitious young warrior leading a great army. Yo, that's sick. That is sick. Dude, it literally looks like an old Chinese traditional painting. Like, that's fucking amazing. Anders, who used the power of chi to heal me. He taught me how to give chi. Did you see that in the flashback, Mr. Ugwe was talking to all the panda people, dude? That's fucked up. Sorry, Mr. Ugwe? What the- is he our teacher now? Our turtle teacher? Yes, he's my teacher. I'm gonna become the fucking dragon warrior, bitch. Okay, so what do I have to do? You have to come home with me. Yes, abandon your other father and come with me. I know I abandoned you your whole life, but... He didn't um, abandon... He's saying that he didn't and that he got him. I don't believe him. I don't believe him. I'm going to be dead ass with you right now. I'm not buying it, dude. And I can only master Chi by knowing who I really am. Well, I'm a panda. And then he's going to find out that all along, I'm not one of them. My father is a goddamn duck. And then that's, and then he's going to have superpowers at the end of the movie and he's going to win. Like, that's how it's going to work. Is he going to start laying eggs at the end of the movie? Does he just learn that every fucking movie? Is every movie the same? Every movie, the, every movie is him just realized how cool his dad is. That's every Kung Fu Panda movie. How you can, whoa. 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 It's really not that impressive. Like, just in the grand scale of things that we've seen in the movies, like, this is not, like, even top five, to be honest. Yeah, this shit is mid as hell. Like, Gary, Indiana looking ass. Like, your your parents are from like, the Midwest. Like, it's not that nice, bro. Like, like clean your fucking up. roofs. There's so much moss there. That's disgusting. Okay, Mid. but that panda milf was kind of bad. I mean... In like a weird way, like in like a metaphorical sense, I guess. Well, I, there's no way to say a panda's bad in not oh, a weird way. So. I would love a panda milf. How do they have so many kids? Pandas are endangered. Why is there so many new kids? These things don't f each other. We call it a snack list. That's right. Yum, 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 yum. Uh, we'll make you another one. This is the Midwest, though, because his whole family is extremely fat. Are they racist, too? They're racist and fat. Voting for Trump. It's time. What's that? My hat. What's that? My pig. What's that? My wing. What's that? My dumplings. Most realistic kid. <laughs> My dumplings. But he pointed his balls. That was a joke that you don't understand as a kid because he pointed down. And he said, my dumplings, bro. Oh my god. Bro, his fucking duck balls. Thumbnail. Put his duck balls in the thumbnail. No, 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 you are tigress. Shut up. I don't need this fucking panda relationship baiting, bro. Fuck off. Please try to save all other compliments until after the performance. Me? No, I didn't say. Shh, shh, shh. The BBW, bro. The, oh my God. Poe's family just lives in Texas. Poe likes them though. He likes them big. He likes them chunky, bro. Bro, she's like the Lizzo of the panda community, bro. Destroying the Jade Palace and everyone in it. He's not as hot as the last two villains. Yeah, Shen and Tai Lung were just had so much sex appeal to them. Well, nobody said this was gonna be easy. 
He has weed, weed leaf. Oh my goodness, he does. That's why they're so peaceful and calm in the Panda Society. They're all smoking weed. Poe would be the kind of fucker who would make weed his whole personality, though. Let yourself fall into it. Got it. So basically, Poe has to learn to spin dash in order to beat the final villain. Is he gonna roll down the fucking hill and knock Kai down like a bowling pin and then he's just gonna kill him? <laughs> and then it's gonna say, strike. Much better. Dude, they're literally smoking weed. Like, that that's a metaphor for them passing the blunt right now. He's smoking that shit. Oh, is his mom dead? Mom, she's dead, remember? In the last we movie? saw her die in the last movie. Bro, reused animation, lazy reused movie. Animation. Lazy, lazy movie. Lazy, literally lazy. one piece. Lazy, literally ah. one piece. One out of ten, one piece. One piece. What do you think the one in the one piece is for? It's for one out of ten, shitty thing. Sucks bad. I don't know. I just thought maybe the mom survived since the dad was alive. Dads don't die. In general? They fly. <laughs> what does that mean? Dads don't die. They fly. And there's a guy like standing on a cliff looking off into the sunset. He has wingspans out like he's, he's, with the <laughs> this guy. he's like a bird, bro. Nice. The, this there's tune's going hard, though. This one's hard as fuck. This back, that's backing track. Bam, 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 I didn't bam, know bam. they had the banjo in China. I am not fit. Little kitten? He called little her kitten. little kitten. Little Discord kitten. Oh my god, he's a Discord mod. He was moderating Ugwe's Discord, but then Ugwe found out he was grooming miners and he had to put him down. I'm not gonna lie, this action scene is hard as fuck. The best awesome. thing you've ever seen. Dude, that would be crazy if there's just a crazy, brutal, bloody scene where they chop the snake in half and then the top half slithers away still. Like, that shit would be disgusting. Poor Jackie Chan, bro. Why? They're giving him the worst lines in the movie. <laughs> when Jackie Chan signed up for the first Kung Fu Panda movie, they're like, you can be in the movie. We're just going to give you two lines of dialogue. And he said, you know what? That's chill. It's a one time thing. And now Is it's he the still third alive? Movie. Yes, I think he's yes, still alive. Yes. Yes. I don't know why I thought it Jackie Chan was dead. Oh my god, bro. I don't like how he just fucking... Dude, like, he, he just took a hit of that Shifu pack, bro. <laughs> oh. Did he slap her ass while he was running around? I don't think so. That was my head so. cannon, yeah. I don't That was think my head so. cannon, too. I heard it, too. I heard the <laughs> spank. Bro, that's me right now, because I'm not hard watching this movie. This movie is lame as hell. This movie gave me a dysfunction can we make that the title kung fu panda 3 gave us a real dysfunction for some reason i just don't think that title is gonna fly i just don't think it's true though like i'm i can get hard i can get hard right now. look tigers is on screen i'm good i am totally at one with my panda parts now why won't you show me because i don't know it it literally <gasps> just sounds like walter white is yelling at poe right now like that's just what it sounds like jesse you turn around jesse Jesse! He should have like an Anakin Skywalker moment where he kills he all the kills other pandas. The whole that would be all, but only the only the children. <laughs> he looks kill. like he's about to do it. He's so oh, pissed. He's about to eat them. He's about to eat them, bro. Oh my god. Oh my, and then he absorbs all of their chi and then uses that power to beat uh, Kai Senna. He's just gonna do a spirit bomb. He's just gonna do a Dragon Ball spirit bomb. That's what's gonna happen. He's gonna it's like it. the. It's like the painting of that one guy eating his, like, child or whatever. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking about. Yeah, what imagine the, that, but it's Poe instead. What the fuck? You guys are looking at dads eating kids? It's, it's like a, a pretty classical painting. painting. Yeah, it's really famous. I forgot what it's called, though. It's a Kronos, it's called, I think. I'm hungry. Saturn. <laughs> Saturn eating his kid. It's called High Hungry, I'm Dad. That's what it's called. Saturn devouring his son, yes. <laughs> Saturn having a tasty-ass meal. That should be Poe, but with all the children in the village. This is not gonna yeah, pretty lame. Not what? How is lame. this gonna help him? This movie's just lame. This movie. <laughs> that's. Like, I don't think it's bad. It's kind of just underwhelming. It's just like I feel like they raised the coolness bar so high that it was like, where do they go from there? You and Poe's life doesn't mean less for me.
It means more for Paul. Kiss their gay gay dad. Oh my god. Oh, what if cause they both don't have partners. What if he looks at at the wife he said, like, You could do better start making <laughs> out with him, bro? Oh my god. <laughs> I can That's be your wife. Up, man. That's he he up. puts the wife's painting in the fire. This is your new family, bitch. Yo, that would be so fucked <laughs> that would up. Go hard. I just have to get to Kai, grab his finger, and then skadoosh back to the spirit. He said it. He said skadoosh, bro. He said Woo! you can't just waste yes. your skadoosh yes. on a hypothetical. No, you get what two the skadoosh. Fuck? He's always had at least two skadooshes per movie. Okay, that's the first skadoosh. We get the next one later. But the more he uses it, the less power it gets, you know? I am not, not a master of chi, okay? I don't know if I'm the dragon warrior. I don't even know if I'm a panda. How do you <laughs> not know if you're the dragon warrior? What were the last two movies for, Po? Stop regressing as a character. You're driving me insane. <laughs> it looks like they're in like, like fucking heaven. Like they're all gonna die. <laughs> it's like him remembering all his lost comrades. <laughs> I'm a fan of this because Poe's training like child so soldiers right now. That's oh. my favorite part of it. Now try it with these. Now try it with these. He pulls out two AK-47s. <laughs> and go, go shoot up that place right there. Okay, pitch. He's gonna say skadoosh. Then his 100 child soldiers are gonna get <laughs> de demolished in seconds. <laughs> yeah. He literally this, has this child is just the crusade. soldiers. This is just like the That's, child holy crusade. That kid on the right is like three years old. Why are you bringing them into battle? I can't read. <laughs> Neither can I, son. We look at the pictures, son. We can't read that kind of <laughs> text. Don't worry. I'm glad he showed up, like, right after they finished training. Bro, he's such a fucking nerd. He's just putting down his D&D &D pieces. He's putting down his chess pieces, bro. And so is the snake. I'm glad they paused so we could laugh at that. What? This is so lame. I don't know what else. This is so. This is so lame. It's a pretty big I couldn't downgrade think of a less cool climax. Double dad defense. Left dad. They're gay. Like, I'm sorry, but there's no other way to put it. I mean, it. like, you would be an expert on this, right? Yes, like, you I'm would an expert know. on gay dads, and Poe has gay dads, okay? Sorry, buddy. I thought I'm he was gonna say skadoosh, what the man. fuck? Skadoosh. Ah! Ah! Nope. Wait, it didn't do anything. Did Ugwe teach you that little trick? They ner someone in chat says they nerfed it, bro. They nerfed skadoosh. The fucking devs, It was bro. too OP. Like, Poe just kept, like, running through everyone, The second bro. I start maining Poe, they fucking nerf him. Like, they do this every time. Dude, I don't want to be that guy, Poe, but they're kind of beating your ass in the quote tweets right now. Like, you are not doing very good in this fight right now. Poe! Son! He's gonna kill himself. He, Poe literally just killed himself. Poe just committed. killed himself. What killed himself. the fuck? His, his, his winning strategy was committing suicide. Kiss. Uh, I guess that's okay, too. Uh, punch is equal to a kiss in your book, bro? That's... You've got some bad history, I think. I think you have some it's drama. It's, it's, make, it's make love or war in my book. Dude, what the fuck is this? Poe is like a biblical <laughs> being right fuck? now. How what the, the fuck are they gonna make a fourth movie? That is a strong stream. A r impressive stream. Wait. No. It's too much. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. This is so goofy. As I hoped you would when I sent the message to your father. Oh, Master Ugwe sent a message to his father. So now it's not some magic bullshit. Master Ugwe literally it's did it. It's Master Ugwe's magic bullshit. Oh my god, they're suing it. They're oh. playing the song again. They're We're playing CeeLo. Their We're CeeLo. Skadoosh. But what the what? fuck was what? that? What? What? Pig, what? what? That? Why? Why did they say it? Only Poe gets to say this it. This movie has ruined Skadoosh for me. Skadoosh was the best thing ever, and they we literally Kung ruined Fu it. We Panda 3, and it ruined Skadoosh. Kung Fu Panda. That's the title. Kung Fu Panda 3 ruined Skadoosh. That's going to get so many clicks. Is there a post-credit chat? Yeah, there is post-credits. All right, let's skip to it. But the, the credits are so fire, man. David Cross, he's very cross. 
What is this song? This is the worst song ever made. What is this? What the? Uh, this is the worst Toro. thing ever. Guillermo, yeah, Guillermo del, Toro. del Toro. He was the executive producer. There was no end credit scene. Chat lied to us. Chat, again. I fucking hate you guys. Chat, hey chat, I hate you guys. You lied to us yet again. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you lie? Yet again, you fucking lied to us. Uh. Yo, look, they're dry hand drawing the DreamWorks. That's cute. That's Whoa. cute. Oh my god, and we get the in the logo. Oh my god, we're in DreamWorks. This is the dream. Okay, this is all cool. This is all very cool. But Jack Black is not singing. And there can only be one Poe at a time, okay? That's just science. No, wait, what was her name? Bao? Fan, font? Uh, I need them to say the names. <laughs> Why do they look disgusting? Oh my god, look how small his face is. Their proportions are like completely wrong. Look, look at the fat one. Oh my god, the big guy. In the old times, when a kung fu student pledged their commitment to kung fu. Yeah, these, these, they got some illnesses. I don't know. A thousand years of, of kung fu panda inbreeding. And now the pandas look like this after a thousand years. This is in the future. And pandas are so lazy. They never want to have like course they're so lazy that they just fuck their sister or whatever yeah it's it's just a lot easier because they're right there the dragon master poe <laughs> uh, my son uh, he's coming here yo where is poe he's coming they said he's coming i want poe i want poe right now oh my god this looks so it looks so sweet bro this is thrilling action yo he got three dumplings in his mouth at once i could i could do 12 dumplings Oh my god, it's Kung Fu Panda. Can you imagine if they just gave him like a beard for no reason? Like to make it look like he's older? So how are we getting this bad boy all the way back to the village? Great question. This follows the DreamWorks trope of the TV only characters being the worst characters in the show. Multiply that number by four. I wish their character designs had like something that distinguished them from each other more because we have girl fat guy but then the other two i'm like how do i remember which one's which you know what i mean wait does this actually take place a thousand years in the future they have statues of the villains from the original movies poe is still alive i don't think kung fu pandas live a thousand years but what if when he became the dragon warrior he also gained the curse of immortality that's actually a valid theory wait they got the powers this is just a lego ninjago isn't it so is poe going to be the master shifu in this situation like he's gonna have to train them Who is that? A kangaroo? What the fuck is that animal? I think that's an Egyptian, Canadian, Chinese mole rat. Oh, dude. Those are actually like pretty like common in my area. I got one in my like back room. Yeah, guys, something supernatural definitely happened in that cave. That's gumball. Oh, it's gum. It is gumball. It sounds like one of the three gumballs, whichever gumball it was. It's not the one that uh, slapped Dream, but the one of the other ones. Yo, Dream and Drake should make an album together. That's all I'm saying. Dude. Don't get my dick hard. Like, stop, stop, bro. You don't gotta say that shit. We're recording. I heard screaming. It's all good, Grandma. Yep, nothing to see here, old timer. Keep it moving. I love the dialogue. It feels so like normal. The way the kids talk is like weirdly modern for the setting. I feel like all the Kung Fu Panda dialogue had like that faux Chinese to it. When Poe says skadoosh, it really sounds like old and Chinese and such. Surely the children must know how to get back into the temple. Do ask nicely. Oh my God. Is that the eagle? The villain? Wait, that represents America. So the villain is America. And he's like, I'm coming to China to force them to buy opium. Is that what's murdering the pandas in real life? The pandemic is, is they're just fucking snorting opium. The universe totally chose us to be these like supernatural kung fu masters. And okay, yeah. It's so weird to think about this actually like being quote unquote canon. Cause like, what the fuck is Poe even doing in this god? He's just chilling. He's eating. He's like an unemployed friend on a Tuesday afternoon. <laughs> Maybe this is like his vacation spot. Like he comes here to chill during the summers or whatever. Yeah, this is like a Walmart parking lot wait a minute is this the spirit realm this show isn't brain rot it's just boring yeah. i'm kind of like disappointed this isn't more brain rot can you be quiet he's talking to Ugwe right now this is the plot man this is the plot 
The universe has chosen you to teach these children. The universe has chosen you to teach these fucking annoying children. Isn't that, doesn't that sound so entertaining, Jack? Isn't this exactly what you want? Yes, I really want to see Poe do a fucking high school show where he's a teacher. You haven't seen these kids. They're hopeless. He has had like 20 seconds of interaction with these children. And he's written them off completely. They wouldn't leave me alone and let me eat my dumplings. They're hopeless losers. He wants to maintain his unemployment benefits. If he gets employed, the government's gonna take them all away. This is our last chance to convince Master Poe to teach us Kung Fu before he leaves tomorrow. Yeah, what type of bad neighborhood do they live in? They were still... <laughs> they didn't even leave the town. They're living in the Panda Ghetto. Does this guy not take fall damage? What the fuck was that? You see that? He's the ultimate dragon warrior, man. You don't take fall damage anymore. Why are you playing this genre of music in Kung Fu Panda? The action choreography is so much worse than Legends of Awesomeness. You kids need to get out of here! Is Poe not, like, fucking OP? Why is he struggling with these random ass goos? He's supposed to be, like, OP, right? I'm the Dragon Master! Dragon Master? It's Dragon Warrior. You're not the Dragon Master. Fake Poe. Fake Poe. That's my theory that this is like a gorilla in a posu and it's not even actually him. Let him go! See, he has to get beaten by these buffoons so that they can use their magic powers. Why are the kids stronger than Poe in episode one? <laughs> this is not cringe. This is awesome. This is just a Marvel movie, bro. This shit probably happens in every Marvel movie ever made. Oh man, how come I'm the turtle? The turtle? You mean Ugwe? Put some respect on his goddamn name. Are you serious right now? Imagine your aura being Hitler Peacock. Oh my god. I dream of nothing more. First day of class. <laughs> Piss. No. Bad show. Legitimately, there was a piss cue and the animators forgot to add the piss. Boo. <laughs> Smells like dying in here. Dude, me showing up to <laughs> the funeral like, ew, it smells like dying in here. Where's my fucking axe body spray, bro? I feel like the large, larger panda is, he's a little fruity. I'm gonna be honest, like it's giving a James Corden vibe, maybe. That's such a compliment. James Corden is a, he is a gay, right? He's an honorary gay, you know what I mean? Like. White Tiger was an excellent healer and such a chill guy. His chillness was legendary. I kind of like what Poe's saying right now. He's <laughs> like, this tiger's the chillest dude ever made. He smoked hella weed. He skateboarded on the weekends. He was actually like the chillest dude ever. Master Black Tortoise. What, what? So we just unlocked that kid's personality. He said, what, what? He's like a hood rapper. One of those hood rappers. Using only his chi. Oh, yeah. Yeah, personality unlocked, bro. He's one of them hood hood rappers from O-Block. I'll take the turtle. I like turtles. No, guys, come on. You, you see? You see? I told you. Oh, he's kind of fruity. He's kind of fruity. <laughs> I like turtles. If that turtle was a cute guy, I would kiss him. Put the homophobic dog on screen. Oh, my God. What are those disgusting creatures in the background? Ew, ew, ew. Get them off. Kill them now. Dude, I want to get bug spray and spray these motherfuckers in the eyes. Many blessings, sisters and brothers. <laughs> this guy does not look like a Kung Fu Panda. He looks like an Angry Birds character. He's the eagle that you get if you pay like $20 in Angry Birds. I was going to say that I actually think his character design is pretty solid. For like an original TV character. I'm not saying Angry Birds is bad. Mind. Wait, so he chills with the rats during the day and then he fucks with like the hyenas at night? <laughs> we still don't know what they are. <laughs> what are these things? <laughs> now we actually have some like Chinese-esque music, like not like random American guitar. This is like video game training lobby music and I kind of vibe with it. I think we're on the right track. We're just regular kids. No, you're not. You're pandas, bro. You're not regular kids. What do you mean, man? Well, who's this guy? Core if he was an animal. Hmm. I'm writing up my next Billy in the Milk script. Sad joke at this moment. <laughs> He's a goat. He looks like the goat in Hoodwinked. Have you guys seen that movie? No. There's a goat in Hoodwink that does like that yodels. He's like, Yodely, da, da, wee, li, li, no. <laughs> It's pretty awesome. 
What the hell? They killed my Tumblr daddy. Are you serious right now? They killed the goat? That's the rap game killing Kanye. I come bearing a message for the dragon master. Bandits. This is Poe's dad, right? No, it's just the same kind of bird. Are you serious? Someone in the chat says that's dark ping, bro. It's like in Smash when you pick the alternate colors for the character. That's just dark ping. Come on. Why are they licking him? What the fuck? They He's a victim. What is happening? Back already? Huh? Yeah, from Wuhan Village. Yeah, your students said they give you the message. <laughs> okay, I liked when he kicked the baby. That was pretty good. All these things look ugly as hell. Oh my god, why do they even look like that? They don't even look like that in the movie. Wait. Is every episode of the show being the kids are just gonna fight random people and then Poe has to go save them, but then the kids end up saving themselves? What's the ding dang plan, leader? <laughs> No, 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 no. <laughs> it's like they took normal dialogue and then put it through a cringe filter. What the ding dang plan, leader? Shut up. Oh my God, that was bad, man. It's giving Megamind girl for sure. I'm a dragon. I am very blue. I am the one that's don't what about it. One thing, I don't know why. He died with the tongue out and everything, bro. No way. He died a freak, okay? Taking the heat for your mistake? That's that's legit leader skills right there. <laughs> oh, she's the leader one. If you're a girl watching this growing up, like the fact that a woman can be a leader, this did more for <laughs> women than Hillary Clinton. What did Hillary Clinton do for women? Shiggity, check this out. Did a little research a Rooney. Poe gets the pass, okay. What did Poe say? He said, Shiggity, check, check this, this out. out. Did a little research a Rooney. <laughs> oh god, man. You look well, master. Did he suck the shit out of the goat? Guys, I'm scared of birds. Guys, did he suck the shit out of the goat? Wait, that's Mushu from, uh, no, it's not. That's not, sorry, Mushu. I forgot that Poe could fly. I forgot that he can do that. No, this is a dream, man. Can we just talk about how Poe has been, con he's like Mark Grayson from Invincible. He's been only taking L's in this show so far. Imagine being such a loser, you, you go to your dreams and you continue to take L's. Okay, uh, I feel like there's more to it than that. I was not expecting Uwe to show up so often. He's like, yo, what's up? How's it going? I'm just a little bored. Just want to check in to see how things are going. Take a hit of the good good, Poe. You'll be floating like me in no time. How does he fit on the bed? He is so fat. There's no way he goes to sleep with food already there so that when he wakes up, he can eat. So how did you get the cave to open before? What? Wait, he's doing a Kamehameha? What the fuck? They're the ones with the powers, Poe. They should have just done this first. Yeah, why didn't you try caressing the rock? Why is Poe even here right now? He tried everything, but no, these kids try for five seconds and they solve it instantly. We're so cool. We're so cool. Could you be any more full of yourself? I, I don't like you guys. They're so unlikable. This is crazy. <laughs> Yes! Cray cray, no way he said that. Yes! Man, I'm awesome. Shut the fuck up! They can't fucking shut up for two seconds. Now listen, you dear vampire, whatever your deal is. Oh my god, I just realized what they're trying to do. They were trying to do Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, but with pandas. Oh. But you see, they forgot to make them friends. They forgot to make them friends. They forgot to make them funny. <laughs> they forgot to make it fun. At least we still have this, though. Whoa! You got the scroll! Wow. <laughs> wow, you got the scroll. Everything he says is so over the top. There ain't nothing on... Oh my gosh, just like the scroll in the first movie. Remember when it was nothing? Hey, Dragon Master! Wait, this is the, the, the sexy one from the movie. The sexy one. Sorry, you're going to have to point on the screen where the sexy one is. I don't see one right now. Right side of the screen. Right side of the screen, buddy. Right side. 
Uh, everything okay, son? Brian Cranston. Is it actually Brian? It is. He was actually going to be a main character in Better Call Saul, but he'd rather voice in this show than actually be in the show. Dad? Mom! Son! That's not your dad. He doesn't look like you. That's a duck. Adoptive parents are real parents, Jack. What do you- what? It's a duck. Get over it. Didn't you already get over it in the movie? You abandoned him, bro. Or did he didn't do that, but I'm just said that for the video. <laughs> Loki, that is like the most evil character in the entire Kung Fu Panda franchise. Like he's killed so many people brutally in this move in this show already. I, I think you might be forgetting about the character that like literally did a genocide. <laughs> Uh, I hate. Uh, I've never felt more hate. I don't think guns are a good thing to have, but if I were in Poe's village right now, I'd be open carrying in front of this woman. You know what I mean? Your panda dad keeps putting his grubby little hands oh, in my little car. Dad, to hear dad! With you. His dads are fighting, bro. This is fucked up. This is literally the worst thing a TV series based on a movie can do. It's just tread old water. The dad should kiss. Yeah, I agree. Only arises from her cocoon once a millennia to consume the souls of the unworthy. This guy looks like a Muppet. Like, he doesn't even look like an animal. Well, he has four arms? What animal is he? What? He's like a Looney Tunes. I'll take two orders, please. I reserve the right to refuse service to anyone. No, you can't refuse service to someone just because they're gay. Okay, the Supreme Court passed that, okay? And they're going to turn that around pretty soon. We share the same son. We are not friends. We're lovers. We're gay. We're family. Oh my god. A bunch of kids and masks. Huzzah! Really makes you admire the dictators who outlaw this stuff, huh? <laughs> What's it just a weird prolash? What? 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 what the fuck? What the hell was that line? They're like, yeah, we should we should oppress all the artists. We should be burning books. What the fuck was that? Fart Cloud appeared. Oh my god, it's a monster. What in God's name is happening in this show now? Did you see that? Did you see the high-pitched scream? The gay one just ran away. <laughs> you think that hurts? I don't feel it. He quiffed everywhere. That was hilarious. Thank you. Poe continues to do nothing in the show. Except say cray cray and chickity chickity check this out. I'm getting riggedy riggedy wrecked tonight with my boys. This sucks. <laughs> Things are getting real weird now, huh? You want to be TMNT so bad, but you're not. You're not and you never will be. It's been so long. Like, what is the gap in time between the third and fourth movie? Do you think Poe has, like, a daughter? Like, with that Mei Mei Tiger. character? Wait, who's Mei Mei? Mei Mei's the annoying panda woman. Oh, who, like, fuck. It's gotta be Tigress, bro. <gasps> tai Lung! That's for the first movie. God, I'm such a fucking loser reactor. <laughs> Shut up, Jack. Apparently, like, the original pitch for this movie was there were going to be, like, a mix of live action and animation. You're lying. No. It's a real interview. There is a universe out there where we could have gotten a CG Kung Fu Panda teaming up with IRL Aquafina. That sounds horrible. That's how, I'm so happy that didn't happen. We have to talk. Absolutely. Let's talk. Right after the ceremony. Yo, that's crazy. Poe gets just a little bit famous and he forgets Shifu. And now he's showing, oh my God, dude. This is like the YouTube when they get their 100K plaque. They're like, this is my YouTube plaque. It's covered in dust because I left it in the corner of my room and didn't touch it. <laughs> Unfortunately, no, they're off on super cool kung fu missions. Okay, because they're not in the movie, right? Or like they play a very small role. It's really beautiful that they have three shows and four movies and they have still never figured out how to do anything with the Furious Five. I feel like that's the most obvious direction is to focus more on them. But then I guess it wouldn't be Kung Fu Panda. Then Aquafina wouldn't be in the movie and that's, that's a big no. You will advance to the highest level in all of kung fu. 
spiritual leader of the Valley of Peace. What's next? Leader of the Communist China Party? Like, how far can we go? He's already the ultimate dragon warrior. Oh my god, Poe is a bear, just like Winnie the Pooh. It's just the natural evolution. Being the dragon warrior is all I know. It's who I am. Not anymore. So is he basically going to fulfill, like, Shifu's role? Yeah, basically. Poe goes through the same character arc in every movie. <laughs> he is content with what he's doing, but the Master Shifu's like, no, you're not good enough. And then he exceeds that. Choose the next Dragon Warrior! Oh my god! Mr. Beast plays the pig! What is happening? The Dragon Warrior! It's me! Oh no, that is really crazy. <laughs> That's so awkward. How are they cheering? That's so evil for him to That's say that. That's actually crazy. That's like Simon Cowell on American Idol. He's like, who is the American Idol? It's me! I'm the reason you're watching this show. You watch so I yell at the people. <laughs> Every pit holds the promise of a mighty tree. Uh, how is this gonna help me find answers? If every pork chop, if every peach were perfect, we wouldn't have pits. <laughs> okay, Steven Universe. Yeah, there we go. All right, Universe. <laughs> oh! 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 This is not working at all. Maybe focus on your breathing. What? <laughs> is that scary? Is it just me or does this not feel like a Kung Fu Panda joke? Yeah, this movie feels really weird. What? <laughs> I know you're in here. Aquafina. Does she play like a similar role that she does in like the bad guys to where like she's a sneaky little guy? Cause she's a bad guy. Nothing about you says dragon or warrior. <clears throat> yeah. This really is the conflict in every single movie. He's epic guy and they're like, well, you don't seem like a very epic guy. Cause you like- Because food. you're fat. You're fat. Fat people could never be cool. And then the fat people are cool and then spits out cereal. <laughs> <laughs> Of Master I'm not gonna lie, when I first saw her character design, I didn't like it because it doesn't look like a Kung Fu Panda character design, but I feel like in motion, it's a lot better. Like actually animated, not on promotional art, it does look better. <laughs> This is definitely like a Roblox mini game, bro. This is a three tile running mobile game like Subway Surfers and Minion Rush and Sonic whatever. Editor, next time we're talking and we're like going on a long winded opinion, just put her dodging all those tiles and then it would be like a clip in Subway Surfers. Oh yeah, yeah. Like, like you put like something that's actually entertaining on the screen so that when people are listening to it, oh. he's not going to stop until the Valley of Peace falls and the Dragon Warrior bows before him. The characters like look more human than in the that's what I was movies. saying. That's literally what I was thinking. Because when that goat started talking, I'm like, why does that kind of just look like a normal guy? It kind of has that look of like cleaned up motion capture where like they did animate, but they use motion capture for a base because they just, they move so humanly in a kind of a creepy way. Yeah, Poe is the only character in this movie. Why isn't Tigress in the movie? Do they just not want to pay Angelina Jolie in this movie? I'm talking about the chameleon. That's kind of weird that they didn't keep the mystery of it being Tai Lung coming back. Like, she just tells him, yeah, it's just someone who shapeshifted. That's weird, yeah. I feel like that could have been, like, an interesting plot reveal. Or, like, we could have seen the character. Like, they should develop the villain of the movie right now and not make Aquafina tell us who the villain is. That's kind of how they did the other movies, yeah. especially with, like, Tai Lung. Like, he was coming. And every single time you saw him, he kept coming and coming and coming. And coming. And then eventually he came. Your job. Is finding a successor. The dragon warrior and I have a deal. Mind your own business, squirrel. I love the body language. It's so different from like every other character. Like it feels like she's just vibing. Yeah. Like she doesn't even care that she's in this movie. And she's got way more sass than like every other character. I feel like it's a healthy addition. Think of it as one last dragon warrior adventure. I'll be back soon. They're saying that straight into the camera. Just think of it as one last dragon warrior adventure. Until we release the next movie. So <laughs> Kung Fu Panda 5. Okay, if they make Kung Kung Fu Panda 5, it has to be about the Furious 5, right? No. It's Kung Fu Panda <laughs> 5. Please. He's always come out on top. And you're right. You're right. But what if you're wrong? They do give, like, like he's calming him down from his panic attack type beat. Like, they yeah. have, like, a loving relationship with each other. I want them to be in love so bad. I want it. I need it. Oh my god, the reverse dolly foe thing they had going on there added a level of suspense to the way they introduced that character. Like, that was solid. That was cool. What's the catch? The rub, the bamboozle. The bamwoodle? You know, the fleece, the rook, the flim flam. Oh, yeah.
Sorry, that was just disgusting dialogue. What was the dialogue? She was like, what's the catch? What's the hook? What's the flim flam? The rub? Because he gave her half the cookie and she's like, I'm a thief and no one gives things for free. They're building it up, man. They're building it up. I don't care what anyone <laughs> says. I'm allowed to have my head cannon. I swear to God, if they don't kiss in the climax of this movie, I'm gonna fucking blow a lid. <laughs> <laughs> a lid. A lid. That's Juniper City. That's where I'll find the chameleon, huh? Just a boat ride away. Editor, you don't have to include this in the video. The fox is kind of bad. It's the Judy Hopps effect. It is the Judy. I actually like, I've been holding it in this entire video since she showed <laughs> stop, up. Stop, stop, stop. I'm sorry, are you accusing me of cheating? I would like to speak to the manager, please. I'd like to speak to the man. That's not even something you would say in that context. You're winning in a casino and you're like, I'd like to speak to the manager. Come and get it. No, 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 no. Don't come and get it. Destroy them. This feels like a worse version of Last Wish. Oh, yeah. Like the way it's paced and the way the characters come in and it's like, I'm going to say my one line and then we're all going to fight. But it's like generic version of that. <laughs> this is such a creative way to like do a scene. The whole environment in which they are fighting it is with respect to the weight on each side because the building is about to fall over. Like that's so creative. I think this belongs to you. I like how Poe's like, sorry, you're not allowed to steal from them, but we're gonna beat them up and assault <laughs> them. Yeah! He said the line! Wait, there's no... Yeah! He used a skadoosh to take out a bunch of fucking stupid, dumb henchmen in a random bar. This is fucking ADHD. This is TikTok cinema. This is what the Mario movie did to animated movies. This isn't a real scene. I'm doing <laughs> Yeah, what is this B plot? It's so stupid. What's the conflict? They both care about Poe and they're going to Poe, but there's no like, what's the character journey happening here? It wasn't easy being a little fox in a big city. I feel like they sped run this character. Usually like that backstory would be like 20 or 30 minutes later in the movie. She's just completely sympathetic, like right off the bat. Oh, that guy, he drinks like a fish. That was such, what the? I'll expand my rule from Juniper City to every city and town and village. Okay, if she's a shapeshifter, is it blackface? If you're a white person who can shapeshift and you shapeshift into a black person, is that blackface? How has Poe never seen that heard of this city before? Apparently Poe just jacks off and plays video games all day. How are you a fish out of water? You're the dragon warrior. This is your fourth movie, Poe. The smells. Me entering Japan, like, actually. <laughs> you stick your head in through the window of a random person's <laughs> house. Give me your udon! The law has better things to do than look for me. Hey, Fox, we've been looking for you. Groaner. Groan. <laughs> Groan Fu Panda is not what I want to be watching right now. The Kung Fu Panda! Wait, how did he get locked up? What? Also, he was about to- Okay, what is Poe's logic in this movie? She is a wanted criminal. And in the last scene, he was like, you always have to do the right thing. And the right thing was allowing her to be locked up. Yeah, the right thing is getting her arrested and publicly executed. We gotta get out of here before they call for- Wait, what? Hold on, this music? It's crazy train, bro. It's crazy train core. It is crazy train. It is. That's awesome. You know, I appreciate that they actually made an effort to put it in the style of the setting. Yeah, they want to be Avatar so bad. <laughs> yeah. That was so my cabbages moment right there. Oh, is that really you? Han, my old mentor. That's the dad from uh, Everything Everywhere. There are other ways to bring peace than by kicking butt. Oh, come on, really? Now? Yes. Why does this is like a running joke in the movie? There's a lot of running jokes in the movie, and it's got like a 40% hit rate. <laughs> That's pretty high. I give it 20. <laughs> no, 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 no. I think you're misunderstanding the fundamental More point violence. of what. Ultra violence! Slowly turns into an animated clockwork orange. Yeah, this place doesn't look very friendly. It doesn't look very friendly to people like us, like us gays. They have like an LGBTQ flag on the side and there's like an X through it, like no gays allowed. Now this 
can go one of two ways. Cut this out. Why? This is such a weird decision. All of this time could have been spent developing Poe and Aquafina more. Yo, I'm a pee during this useless scene. It's hard to understand what you're saying. <sighs> <laughs> it seems kind of worth it just to see the house fall off. Skadoosh. Skadoosh isn't a word. And skablam is? Skablam does not hit the way skadoosh does. Let's just be honest here. Wait, do you think the fox is going to betray Poe in the second act low sure? point? <laughs> this is like sleepover as a kid, bro. There's not enough bed, so you're all sleeping on the floor. <laughs> She plugged up his nose and then it turned into a fart. That was actually a messed up scene. Look out! Huh? Oh my god, she sold him out! She sold him out! Here, use my staff! All right, stand back! Here I go! No! Jen? No, she stole it! <laughs> betrayal! She had no fear. Such potential. This would have hit more if we spent more time with the characters instead of cutting away to fucking dads. <laughs> Imagine like in the middle of this scene, they cut back to the dads. <laughs> Kung Fu may be performed by the body, but its secrets are housed in the spirit. Am I crazy or was there no reason for her to be a chameleon? She was like, oh, you're gonna need someone to help you find the chameleon because they can shapeshift into anything. How you find them? But she's just like in a palace. That wasn't really a problem. Also, wouldn't it have been like make sense to use her chameleon powers to like maybe make her look like Jen and that's how he was tricked or something? I was just doing what I was told. Apologize later. Right now I have to stop the chameleon. Oh! Oh my god, I knew it! I guessed the children's movie! Did she switch up already? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, he's falling so far. Well done, Jin. You never said you were gonna hurt him. What is this? You never said you were gonna hurt him. You're just gonna steal from him and ruin his life. What do you mean? <laughs> of course she's gonna hurt him. What? Well, this is quite the cliffhanger. Ah! That oh my god! so genuine. Yeah, I was gonna say, <laughs> that scream there, like, actually scared me a little bit. <laughs> what? 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 No, save me! <laughs> Why would you be happy to see your dad here? Like, he's going to die with- It's okay. How the fuck did they get here? They went to the top of the mountain and then fell off because they saw Poe falling? What the fuck is the logic? Nothing's ever been the same since. Change doesn't always have to be a bad thing. Change doesn't always have to be a bad thing. You see, your other father and I, well, we've changed a little bit together. That's the reason we came all this way to talk to you. We're gay for each other, Poe. And the day you stop being those things is the day when, yes, you stop being useful to me. She kind of gives me Yzma vibes. She needs a cronk. She desperately needs a cronk. Oh, so Tylon does come back. Wait, you took the power out of him? She sucked him dry. Yes, I got it. I read in an interview that apparently they used some AI for the transformation stuff. Do you want me to hate this movie more? I'm already <laughs> not liking this movie, and then you throw in AI? Mmm, Peach. <laughs> she runs off. She's like, I have to plant this. I won't let anyone else get hurt because of me. So the dad showed up and they were like, we're here to save you. Change is okay. And he's like, thanks, dads. Bye. Amazing. I'm glad we had like 20 minutes of setup for that. I made a mistake. So did I. Trusting you. Is Poe going to hold a, a grudge in here? <laughs> he's so evil. Like, isn't Poe supposed to be like a mature guy who would probably get over this? Like we're on movie four. He would try to be understanding in this situation. Oh my god, get out of here. It's <laughs> oh, kind of cute, though. That's cute. See, the thing that pisses me off is, like, I like their relationship. It's just so undeveloped. Aquafina and Jack Black, they kind of got, like, some good chemistry. I hate to say it. I am a terrible friend. Friend? That feels a little generous, no? <laughs> <laughs> I know you think it might be too late for a bunch of cheats, thieves, and cutthroats like us to change our ways. She's literally fucking standing on the soapbox right now. I think you're missing a fundamental point. Bye. 
This is the same joke again, same joke again. It's just like they repeat a lot of gags, but they don't really change them. It's just like the literal exact same joke again. The chameleon is pulling spirits from the spirit realm and draining us of all our moves. You know what I realized? The Fantastic Five are not in this movie because if they were, this wouldn't be a competition. Low key, they clean house pretty quickly. I feel like if they were in this movie, the chameleon would steal their powers and they would be in these cages right now and the stakes would be higher. And like Poe would actually care about them being locked up. Now this can go one of two ways. It's again, it's the same thing. It's like they constructed half of a movie and then they just played it again. I'm the chameleon, I do nothing but change. Only on the outside. Oh my god. Oh god. <laughs> oh my god. No, because I didn't understand anything about the movie beforehand, but now I understand. I get it now. Master Elephant's trunk twist. Oh. Yo, that feels like a sexual violation right there. Grabbing that trunk, slathering it between his booty cheeks. That, that is a sexual violation. I knew I should have left you to rot in the gutter where you belong. <laughs> the way she said that. The peach pit! The most powerful weapon of all. Holy shit, it's like a Dark Souls boss. Awesome! That's my reaction. That is like such a cool moment yeah. for Poe because he's about to fight this crazy ass monster. And even then he's like, yo, that's low key sick though. But I got to kick your ass now, but that's low key sick. No. no. Do you want her play the Gwen when like he tries to grab her in the, in the tower? I thought we were friends. No, no, why wasn't there an evil skadoosh? This movie's only like an hour and a half and it feels like two hours already have passed. Well, it's not because like the movie feels like it drags at all. It's just because like so much shit happens in the movie. Like there's so many scenes that just last a very short amount of time. So we've just been to like so many places. It feels like I have to pee on a road trip. I'm like, let me just get out and stretch my legs real quick, man. I do think it does drag because I'm not invested in anything. Stir, serve, and scablam! 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 <laughs> Ain't no fucking way that they did a scablam! He said it! But you said it after. He's like a TikTok Rizzler, so he has style. He says it after now. He's a TikTok Rizzler, he has style. Maybe Ugwe was right about you. You aren't completely useless after all. Maybe the spirit realm just makes you chill as fuck. Well, they all be smoking that ganja in the <laughs> spirit realm, so. He's, he's like totally chilled out. Kai's such a bad villain, they didn't even give him a voice line, dude. Jen, do something! Third rule. Third rule, kill yourself. Now! Skablam! <laughs> you chose the fox? You know when you know. You know? Marriage. Isn't that what people say about marriage? Interracial marriage. Master Shifu can't accept it because he's a traditional man. He's right. What about me says I'm ready for this? You literally beat the villain of the movie, dude. <laughs> I didn't even do that. I think that's what makes you right. Do you want a cookie? I'm glad we brought that joke back. I'm, ja I'm Jack. We brought black. Ah. Ah. Peace. Are you ready to begin your training? This is the best part of the movie. Here's where Jack Black does the fucking Britney Spears. I brought a little help. Tigress! They literally show up at the credits. What were you doing? What the fuck were they, what were they doing? Yo, they got the DreamWorks logo at the beginning of the show. If you're a TV show and you think you have the right to do something like that, you better be cooking. Once again, here, tell a poem. It's crazy it took them like 10 years for Jack Black to record for a f***ing Kung Fu Panda show. You think it's just because Jack Black has fallen on hard times? How could he be falling on hard times if he's literally Steve Minecraft? I feel like that question just answered itself. <laughs> China. What? That's the premise? It's Guy Fieri, diners, drive-ins, and dives? <laughs> that actually sounds awesome, though. Hold on. Jack Black going and just eating at random places in China would be an incredible series. Yo, that sounds awesome, bro. This is about to be the best show ever made, man. Wait, it looks like a 
Chinese takeout box. Chinese takeout box. I realized why this show was made the way it was. They were in the writing room. He was executive producer. They were deciding what to do for the show. Jack Black, he post-mated Chinese food and it was running late. It was all he could think about. He's like, f*** it, okay? No kissing. Nice to see you. I named my third child I after you. This is the most recent one and I think it might look the worst. No, it does not. You're forgetting how bad the pause of destiny looked, bro. You're being ignorant to the facts of reality, Core. Oh! This one kind of continues after the third one where like he's the dragon master and everyone knows him. But in Kung Fu Panda 4, they literally forgot that Poe was the dragon master when he went to the biggest city. And like no one knew who he was. It's very confusing. Fuck them for not paying attention to the lore of Kung Fu Panda, the Black Knight or Knight of what? The Dark Knight. The Goblin! Now hold that thought. Dude, are you fucking kidding me? What is the door physics here? I don't understand, bro. Whoa, what the, the evil weasels? They're gonna kill Poe. He's got the gauntlet! So far, this feels like the same quality as the other two Kung Fu Panda shows. I mean, I like this one more than Pause of Destiny, because with Pause of Destiny, we just fall around four random fuck ass children. At least this one we're watching Poe. I already forgot they were in that show. Oh my goodness, he's got the gauntlet. And then he snaps and half of the people die. Poe just becomes Thanos and he's just hungry. He's like, I'll solve world hunger, here we go. This season's set in China in the middle of like a famine. He's like, well, more for me this way. I don't know what character that is, but they run like a Roblox character. Poe does not know the word aerodynamics. That's way above his vocabulary level. He's an idea, my little pandy. Ah! Jump scare. That looks like Avril Lavigne from Over the Hedge, bro. Cinematic parallels. You don't think it looks like Avril Lavigne from real life? I'm watching Sad Poe right now. Some gay Eastern European shit right here. Something y'all wouldn't really know about. Let the Dragon Master give you a hand with that. No thanks. That is not a Kung Fu Panda character. What in the name of Nintendo dogs just walked across the screen? I was just trying to destroy our village. You're a master at that, and the Wuga Gauntlet is gone. Damn, he got his ass handed to him by two weasels. He's not the dragon warrior. Like, I don't care what title you were given. If you can't fight two weasels that are a tenth of your size, you are not the dragon warrior, buddy. Oh my god, the gauntlet. It's hand city. It's hand city. Wait, if, if it's hand city, then where are the palm trees? <laughs> Taking away your title of Dragon Master. What? They took away his title. This show is insane. There's so much lore. Why is there so much lore in this? This is so serious all of a sudden. I'm so used to the tie-in shows like not mattering at all for the plot. Is that allowed? Like, didn't he like with Master Ugwe in heaven or something? You can't just take away his Dragon Warrior title. You destroy one city and they take away your shit, dude. That literally looks like a fucking Roblox character, dude. That is actually my Roblox skin. Put the text above their head, bro. <laughs> is this bacon hair really gonna try and fight my Kung Fu Ponda? Whoa, that's a lot of whatnot. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot of whatnot. <laughs> I do think this is an interesting clash, though, because, you know, the knight in armor with the big sword, it's like a European way of fighting at this time, while every other character is at least supposed to fight in, like, a Chinese kind of way. Oh, they're here to colonize. Wait, isn't the show called and the Black Knight or whatever? This is the Black Knight. It's the Dragon Knight. I'm a knight. She's kind of bad, though. She is not kind of bad. Jack, be quiet. She is not bad at all. She's kind of attractive. I'm looking for the Dragon Master. And she's British, too. I told you she was European. So she is a colonizer. Just because she's British doesn't mean she's a colonizer. I think it does. Yeah, but the British did colonize China. No, they didn't. When did they do that? <laughs> Name five of their albums, fucking asshole. Name five countries Britain colonized. It'll be easy. Daughter of the Saxon God, Knight of England. <laughs> she's straight up just from England? Wait, it, wait, other countries exist? In this world, like, I only ever thought of China existing. Like, the fact that they just straight up are like, yeah, England exists and it's full of people. Hold on. 
Yes. Aren't they kind of flirty though with it? I feel like they could be a beautiful couple together, to be honest with you. We can't ship Poe with every single woman he comes in contact with. How many women has he come into contact with? Tigress, the fat one, this one, what Aquafina. Okay, now that you now that you spell it out, I guess we have shipped Poe with a couple women. Cause I'm sorta still the dragon master. <laughs> there should be more scenes where in the script it says, let Jack Black do his own thing for 10 seconds. Like, that would make the show like a hundred times even better, bro. And maybe they like don't even script the show. Just let Jack Black come into the studio and say anything he wants and then construct an episode out of that. I lost something! Yo, what is this Bollywood editing? No way we got that zoom in back in like that. Am I watching RRR or something? That was kind of a hard title drop, Loki. Kind of goaded with the sauce. Okay, I, I will at least say I like that the, the show has a story. Like, it actually has a plot. No, 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 no. No, I know it's an L word. Um, Lorelai. Honestly, I forgot her name too. So I'm kind of on his side. What is her name? I actually, I forgot her name as well. I kind of like what they did with the TV show, though, because obviously they couldn't use the same villains as any of the movies or anything. Instead of making, like, any of the villains Chinese, they just made them all European. That's more believable, if anything. She's kind of like Jinx from Arcane. No, she's not. This is our river. Is that Will Arnett? Why does he sound like that? No way they got Will Arnett to voice in this show. He wasn't even in any of the movies. It doesn't sound anything like Will Arnett. Glowy thumb. Weird. Hey, oh. oh my god, this makes so much sense because we were theory crafting that it was going to be all about him traveling all across China and eating a bunch of food. But actually, he has a green thumb, so he's going to plant the food. It's going to be three seasons of him developing a rice field. Watch The Rock. And that was actually Jack Black shouting out one of his friends in the industry, The Rock. So honestly, round of applause for Jack, just being such a nice guy. You've been hiking for three hours and I caught up to you in one. When does the Black Knight show up? There is no Black Knight. There's a Dragon Knight. We're not playing the Black Knight for the Nintendo Wii right now, and this is the opening cutscene. We're Sonic. We're Sonic. Like, I, technically, she's a brown bear. It shouldn't be called the Black Knight, then. It should be called the Brown Knight. It's not called the Black Knight. <laughs> Uh, looks tasty. They have such a great dynamic. I like when Poe says something and then the bear is like, I don't care and I don't like you. Well, just give her a second. She's warming up to him, okay? The other thing about how dangerous it must be for a woman to visit another country like this. She's got to have her guard up. Oh. Oh my. She's not ready for spice because she's white. She's what? She's from England, bro. She hasn't tasted flavor before. They put salt and pepper on her bread and she's like actually seizing. This sword was forged with the black steel of the equinox. Black steel? Black, black knight. knight, right? Steel of the equinox. That is so fun to say. Try saying that. I'm not going to lie. I like their dynamic. She takes everything very seriously and he can't stop joking around. So it leads to clashes in their personalities, which leads to humor as a result. Like, I feel like it's it's pretty textbook. You sound like an executive trying to convince me that the show's good, but I'm not enjoying it. Luthera of Landreth, the Wandering Blade, daughter of the Saxon God, Knight of England. Ever since I played Dark Souls a couple years ago, like, I'm, I'm, I'm sympathetic towards the European like the obsession with with titles and European armor. I understand the hype. I understand the hype. No, no, it is cool. I just think it's like morally the right thing to do to make fun of it. These silly shortcuts and get me to this bridge. <gasps> <gasps> This is just like Shrek where the, it's the bridge and the lava. Poe is the donkey. Is Poe gonna date a dragon and have children with it? Well, she's a dragon knight. And he's a dragon warrior. So together, they'll have a child and it'll be a dragon... Black knight. It'll be a black child. You kind of got to get used to saying we. Go home, Poe. This is my home. I'm the Chinese one. You're the settler. You're the conqueror. How about you leave my land? <gasps> He kills himself. She said one negative thing about him. Kills himself instantly. Wait, maybe he has like, like a degradation fish. Like he needs like a, a more powerful woman to degrade him before he's willing to do something cool. Well, that's what's good about this is that she has to learn how to trust people because she has trust issues because her father abandoned her when she was a young bear. Be 
Yo, this is a fucking awesome two-player video game level right here. This would be so annoying, though. You have to hold a rope and let the NPC cross while also fighting all of these guys. Shouldn't she just, like, walk over? Like, she had all this time to just walk. I was just like, walk faster. Like I will admit, I am engaged in this fight scene, and this is a, a really interesting fight choreography, just the whole idea of it. This, this kind of reminds me of the bridge fight in the first movie that, like, initially blew me away. I wish this show had the action animation of Legends of Awesomeness. Yeah, because the action animation was good in Legends of Awesomeness. But everything else was, you know, uh, uh, <laughs> uh. <laughs> He slid on lava. That's not like ouch, ouch hot. Ouchy. That's like I'm dead. Like I am dead. It's a little ouchy. It's like hot water, you know? It's like ouchy. Ouchies. I just touched molten lava. I'll hold them back. Yoink. Yoink. <laughs> there is no way to say yoink. Yoink. That was awesome. This show desperately needed this character. Like he's the only thing that makes me smile. <laughs> what? That's not how physics works. If he kicked her, he would be pushed back with the same amount of force that he kicked her with. So he would fly to the right. He wouldn't just stay in the same place. No, you see, this is a special kind of ability. It's called Poe Motion. I am the rock. No, you're not. You're, you're a Jack, Jack Black. Black. I love it when we think the exact same thing during a recording core. It really shows how unique we are as people. I am a very unique individual. The thumb wakes up when they use the gauntlet. Seems safe to say. How many episodes does the show have? One million. You know, this show is the longest show ever. It's longer than The Simpsons. It's longer than A Family Guy. Uh, it's longer than every other show they started making in the 90s, and it's just been running continuously ever since. One more episode. One more episode. So, so, so. Ow! What's now, Jen? Cramp! Do you think it's because I'm working too hard? Are these the animators? You gotta get one of those the animation gloves. <laughs> those don't help your hand, Grant. They're just so your hand doesn't get stuck on the screen. Oh, I thought it was to help with your hand. They do make stuff like that for Carpal Tunnel, but uh... That's a snake oil. It doesn't actually work. Yeah, Carpal Tunnel isn't even a real thing. True. <laughs> I'm honestly completely shocked that this is a TV series and it's like one episode picks up after the other. Didn't the last Kung Fu Panda show? Kind of. And it was just Ninjago. This show feels like there's like actual legitimate stakes to it. It's so much more narrative driven than any other children's TV show from movie I've seen. Leave it. There's no time to pick up your miserable junk. Not junk. It took more time for her to say that sentence than it took for him to pick it up. No, the hedgehogs, no! I think they gotta run fast, they gotta run faster! Editor, can you let this guy drop a bunch of coins when he falls? Edit so he, he hits the ground, he drops coins. Actually, editor, don't do that. I'm not gonna make you do a bunch of work for no reason. But make sure you leave in the fact that I said you don't have to do that so people remember that I'm nice to the editors. Editor, put this in. Lip sync to Eden. You suck, editor. Make Eden say that. This is the best show ever made. They could have copy pasted the sound bite from the opening of Legends of Awesomeness. It sounded the same. Sweet. <laughs> oh shit, I get it. It's because he's fat. Uplifting fat joke moment. Well, c clearly her sparklers and poppers were a gateway to that. This is just one random person that they had it out for. And we're gonna execute this hedgehog tomorrow morning. Leaving her in jail means Klaus and Veruca will destroy another city and another. I understand it's just a show and you shouldn't take it seriously, but it's like, they need to do a better job of suspending my disbelief because I'm like, where are the Furious Five? How is Poe struggling with two weasels? Give me a reason to believe what is going on. I'm begging you, please. All he has to do is say sweet again and I think you won't be thinking about those sort of things. True. They just need to dangle the keys for us again, then we won't think. No way. I'm not fighting monks. Clearly has not seen Wonka starring Timothy Chalamet. Everybody knows that monks are just very naturally violent people. And they're bald. And they're bald, so. They're kind of asking for it at that point. Yep. Hurry up. I'm not good at being bad, okay? Hey, what do you mean you're not good at being bad? You bad as hell, Poe. You, uh, you freeing our prisoner there? 
Yeah, yeah, you, uh, you freeing him? What, uh, what you doing there? Why do they sound like that? <laughs> this dialogue is so weird. A surprise? Yeah, cause it's her, uh, birthday? Bro, Poe is spitting with the improv. So he sent me ahead to make sure she didn't eat cake. Sure, sure, a lot of carbs. Yeah, sugar too. Yeah, just uh, sugars are carbs. Oh, is that right? Yeah, a lot of people don't know that. Bro, we had that conf- we literally had that conversation like a month ago, Jack. Thanks a lot, Panda. You've made our jobs a lot easier. I'm sorry, I did the best that I could. Poe is such a p in this show. You're right, Eden. He literally falls over once and he's like, Wah, I can't defeat these four rhinos. You went to heaven and beat God, bro. And now you're losing to four rhinos? Like, you have to get your little mommy to go ask for no pickles? <laughs> He looks so gay. He looks so fat. He was so, so fat, fat and, gay and gay when he ran. <laughs> Remember when we used to just say fake and gay like regularly as a as a cultural people? Ray William Johnson was the one saying it, not me. Play the clip where Ray William Johnson has the lightsaber. Damn. Dude, we've played that clip like 50 times. Did that hedgehog really just moan and go uppies? Uppies, uppies. We freed you. Now tell us what you saw. I saw them steal a scroll. The people are just stealing scrolls. Like in the Paws of Destiny, that's what the villains did too. The world was one great landmass. Pangea. There are no humans on Pangea. Well, they're animals though. And guess what they are, Eden? Oh, shit. You're right. It's not Kung Fu human, bro. The elements were thrown off balance and the world split apart. So the reason Pangea separated is not because of like any continental drift or anything. It's just like some guys with magic powers were like kind of evil. Thanos did it. Thanos did it. Well, we have an unreliable narrator right now. Like what they're saying probably isn't even true. She was a prisoner, right? We can't trust the prisoner, even if they were falsely incarcerated, right? Yeah, why were they in jail, huh? If they were so good. They were scattered, so no one could have this power again. Yeah, they just left one as a question mark, so you gotta keep watching the show if you wanna find out what it is. Is it four seasons? Each season, they have to find one gauntlet. Isn't there only three seasons? There is only three, so they never finished the show. Did they not finish the plot of the show? Chad is saying that they did finish the plot, course. so you are ignorant and spreading misinformation right now. And then someone else said they just don't finish the plot, so now we have conflicting opinions in our chat right now. Fictional drawings for children. We prefer the term graphic novel, and it's based on fact. Jack Black thought he was gonna get the kids with that one. The kids are gonna love that joke, because I'm like with them. It's actually a well-developed art form, thank you very much. To be continued, I hate what it says. Yo, we chose a good place to end, bro. This shit better than Gravity Falls. Can we be honest? Honestly, we could just keep watching the show. If this video gets views, I would be down to just keep watching the show. So glad you guys are gonna do it. Aromer, Alex McLean, Alzheimer's is a bad disease. We should cure it. Andrew Husky, Arachnidroid, Aaron Tates, and Atomic Leon Vento, Blake Rivera, Kane Rivers, Tom Luke, Cosmic Dega, Crystal Bunny, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Grenados, Gub Stargazer, Gurney Snile Yernison, Happy and Egg, Helio, Histrionics Ribbler, Honor Pearson, Hummus, Hydropond, Isaiah Alfred, K99, Kamui, King of the Street, Lilac Moon, Loka Pegged, Brett Han, Michael. Michael Rodriguez, Milan Zekanovic, Merck, Native, Omega Waffles, Oscar Annis, Pablo the God, Patrick Case, Randolph, Pizza Loving Panda, R. Dizel, Rocky Road with Sprinkles, Rothoka, Quinn Christian, Sam, Skyler is Milk's Mama, Kieran Sills, Tyler Russell, Val Explicit, Victoria.